what oh. up? We back. Hello. It is the like Panda chipmunks. Pandemonium. Uh, hello, hello, like hello. Chips. Can you see me? Can you hear me? You sound like chipmunks. <laughs> <laughs> can you hear me? Can you hear me? Yeah, I can hear you. you sound chipmunks, man. I do. I. Nah, I you sound normal know. to me. It sound good on Twitch, but on here, I'm like chipmunks. Oh wow! <laughs> Technology for you, right? It wouldn't be us unless something happened, though. Let's just be honest. Like, True. Murphy's, Murphy's law in oh, in effect. Yeah. Full effect. But yo, uh, go ahead, uh, Rod. You were in the middle of saying something about who was it? Oh, it's me. Hold on. Oh yeah, we were before we started. Um, hey, okay, what up? Getting in and you know stuff happened, and then my stuff messed up. You know how stuff go. <laughs> yeah, it's all good. It's all good. Got me backstage and shit. Pluminati. <laughs> right. Right. But yeah, Rod, right, go ahead. Okay, yeah. We, before you jumped on vocab, we were just talking about um Dragon Ball a little bit. We we're talking about um. Some of the go that we were just talking about how like certain fan creators are doing stuff better than the actual creators nowadays. Oh yeah. So so Jay just brought up Infamous just brought up about um what was it the Gohan um what was it Gohan if Gohan trained every day if he kept training after the cell games. So I had brought up there was a a YouTube series like what if Beerus and Weeze brought back Perfect Cell to fight Gohan because he wanted to see Gohan's potential, and so Gohan so. Perfect Cell killed Videl and Pan. Goku and Vegeta couldn't stop Perfect Cell because they were training. They had been training the day he came back, so they were tired. So Gohan was really on his own, and Gohan barely squeaked it out. And Beerus was like, yeah, "You, you got the potential. You got better, better potential than your dad or Vegeta. You're gonna start training. You're gonna start training with me." Gohan was pissed, but. He, I think he went. On, I forgot how the rest of that fifth way. He went along with it, but he was still pissed at Beerus for doing that. I'm like, that could have been a, that could have been Dragon Ball superheroes. Honestly, mm-hmm. we were just talking about how like Japan spoiled all the new forms there. I was trying to go in blind because I heard about the new form, but I seen them. I'm like, Japan got to spoil. Japan got to spoil everything for for us. I was trying to go in blind on that one. <laughs> yeah, they. They do get the good stuff early, but it's cool. It's cool because eventually we're gonna have our stuff, and then we're gonna have the good stuff early. <laughs> right. That's all it is. That's that's where I'm at with that. Like we gonna eventually get these out here. We got yeah, stories think, for days. Yeah, I think that. Yeah, speaking of this, we well, well, dry. I think the tickets go on sale next Saturday for the for the U.S. release. If I'm not oh, mistaken, yeah, that is coming out. The U.S. release is coming out. Yeah, I'm, about, yo, I'm definitely. Oh, I was just saying the tickets um go. I'm definitely gonna try to see it first weekend out. I'm like, oh, hopefully yeah. go see it. That like that's one of those if you don't, spoilers are like inevitable. <laughs> you're going you're going to get God. <laughs> yeah, I was trying to go in blind with Dragon Ball. Once I knew forms, I'm like, ooh, let me just stay off my Dragon Ball YouTuber because I know they're gonna cover that for the algorithm. Mm-hmm. But mm-hmm. but but it seems like it's doing good, it's doing successful, it's not doing as successful as Broly. But it's 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 been it's a success. They're deeming it a success. Oh, okay, okay. Well, that's good. That's good. I mean, animation is a little bit different. If you want to be honest, the anime from what I've seen, it does look a little bit different. Um, it, and then you're stepping away from that main storyline and bringing Gohan to the forefront. Everybody's not going to be happy about that. Yeah, but what direction were you going to go? You're not going to do the moral. Like, if you've been following the manga, you can't do the last two manga arcs as movies. You just can't. Mm-hmm. They're serious. But what you can do is just... Well, the anime is coming back next year anyway, so that's that's also some news. At least True. The, the rumor is you're waiting for Digimon and Dragon Quest Die to finish up. Can y'all hear me now? We can't. Yep. I don't know what was going on. Y'all sound like chipmunks on my end. Oh, wow. So it was you. you. Yeah, I, I had to start the whole app. Oh, wow. oh, wow. Yeah, like I said, it wouldn't be us unless it was a, an Ishir. An That's Ursher. Right. 
You know, gotta be technical difficulties. Well, uh, per my first words, Ace! Ace! <laughs> what up, dude? We on high cue yeah. today. Oh, uh, bet. Oh, my bet. Top five sports anime of all time. Oh, Yugi's all day. Oh, of course. Got that UU. Yeah, yeah. Speaking of high cue, uh, I think Prince of Tennis. Tennis. Next season's coming out here. I know they released a trailer for the new season. For oh, the Prince of Tennis for Prince of Tennis. Oh yeah, yeah, World Cup. So I heard. Oh, that's gonna be fire. That. Yeah, I'm glad to see Prince of Tennis doing something. That I, that was a great. That was a great series. It should have been doing something a lot sooner. That's all I'm gonna say. That's fair. Oh, I get I, it, I but so late too. I didn't even know about it till like last year. Remember. Y'all was yeah. like, wow. I was like, yeah. I mean, but there's so many out there. It's like, eventually, one of them you had to not have seen yet. I'm saying, bro. <laughs> That's all I'm it saying. is. And That's this right I here, I'm about- playing the clip. I still can't even find the first season. That shit you can't. Gone, bro. Like, I, I think I've everywhere I've looked, okay. you find bro. like, up. it starts at like episode 50. Yeah. Maybe? It starts at 50. Yeah. So I'm like, nigga, I don't want to just jump in the middle. Right. I'll figure it out, though. So, yeah, if I find it, I definitely will let you know. But I have not found it yet. Because I want to watch this shit. Um, Oh, I know. Jay said he wanted to do a Buzz Lightyear review at some point. We can wait a little bit to make sure I'm like... Okay, okay. Um, While we're doing that, I want to throw out a quick just randomness piece. Okay. Couple things. Number one, we got some updates to the stream. So as you all will see in the chat, um, you can sign up to catch your own Pokemon. And so we got there will be random Pokemon that will pop up in the chat. You just put exclamation Poke Catch, and you can catch and start building your own Pokemon team moving forward. So just so you know about that, I think I got like three right now. What do I got? I got Char- Charmander, Fanfy, Puchina, and Wish Cash. That's what I got right now. That's not a bad team right there. It's not. It's not a bad squad. I missed an Abra the other day. I was in the middle Man, of streaming. I that's Abra. normal. That's right. Normal. <laughs> right. Nobody can Abra on their first try. Bruh. But yeah, so feel free to shoot uh, shoot those in there in the chat as you're going through. Catch you some Pokemon as we're talking and enjoy, enjoy, enjoy. Uh, well, oh, quick note. Quick note. Go. Amazon Prime Day is this week. The twelfth and the thirteenth. Yep. Amazon Prime Day is this oh. week. Y'all heard. And also, it's if you're a, uh, and also if you're an Amazon Prime member, don't forget you got one free year of Grove Hub Plus. You can copy hey, as well. Real quick, yo. Go for Hello? it. Yeah. Yo. yo. We got the Grub. Yeah. Get, don't forget to get that Grub Hub Plus one year if you're an Amazon Prime member. Cop that. But while we're talking Pokemon on um, Panda, did y'all see the spoilers for the anime tournament? No. Like who won the last match? No. I did not. No, I don't oh, did, uh, The ones you see? I mean, I'll check it. Yeah, no, the, the second match was this week, was just this week. Oh, okay. okay. It was it was it was OG Lance versus um what's the girl's name? Um oh what's it? Deontay, I think is how it's pronounced. It was Lance, the one, the Kalos champion. So it was Lance versus the Kalos champion. And Lance took an L. He lost? Yes, sir. No, Lance took an L. Yep. He took an L. From who? From the Kalos champion, um, Dianthea. Oh, okay. I can, mm, I can see it, but... Yeah, the Pokemon where Lance had High Dragon, he had a he had a D Max Dragonite, and he had and he had Shiny Gyarados. Mm. See, uh, they playing games. <laughs> but Deonta played him pretty well. She had Aurora's the um the fully evolved um uh, well, Brontosaurus, the Ice Brontosaurus Rock yeah, Pokemon. Yeah, yeah. She had him. She had Mega Gardevoir, and I forgot the other Pokemon. But she played it for real. She had the what was the other? She had a she set up the um reflect and light sheet light screen. 
the ones had no shot. Oh no, that yeah, there wasn't anything you do. Like I still th- so have you all seen uh King's Avatar? No. Nah. It's a Korean anime. If you get a chance, definitely check it out. It's on uh the the live action's on Netflix right now, but the regular anime you would have to find on YouTube. Just type in King's Avatar and it'll pop up the whole first two seasons. That's the only thing you're out. Reason I bring it up is because their stadium, it's a I think MMO fighter, kind of like the is it the Nara Nara Blade Point, Naraka Blade Point thing you're talking about, Jay? That game is it's, awesome. It's like that, but it's like that, and you go in and you fight, but they do it in this 3D studio, and so it's like think about like Pokemon Stadium, but they're fighting. I would love to see us get a new Pokemon stadium game that's like that you know oh, what i mean oh i can see that that'd be fun yeah well, like i, uh, I mean i i mean i'll admit i i was surprised lance had a dynamax i was not expecting that i was like oh lance had a dynamax i wasn't expecting that they had but to I think, pull something yeah because that shiny gyarados wasn't that's your yeah his shiny gyarados got dog walked pretty badly too hey Oh, now I remember her. Set, now I remember on um, the other Pokemon, on um, Beyonce's third Pokemon. It was Gorgas. So she had Gorgas, Mega Gardevoir, and Auroras. So she had all six gen Pokemon. Oh, well, that's, yeah, that's why. Yeah, she used Gorgas. She used yeah. Trick or Treat on um, Gyarados and made it a ghost type. <laughs> oh, wow. Yeah, she, she played, Lance got out with it. <laughs> that's all that was. But Lance was all, but Lance was all power back in the day, anyway. That's so. all he was. He was the, he was the, he was. I hate to say it, he was the dumb jock. He, he was the dumb jock of the Pokemon world, like straight out. Yeah, he and came next through a brute force. Yeah, and next week's the one everybody's been waiting for. The one that should be a dog walk, Cynthia and Iris. That's next week. Ah, what up, Duke? Nope. What's up, kid? Oh, okay. Yeah, bro. There we go. Yes. There we go. Now yeah, we so next him. week, yeah, so next week, Pokemon Emma, we got Cynthia versus Iris. Who y'all, who y'all think gonna take that one? Cynthia and Iris. Hey, I got over the million, man. <laughs> <laughs> you know what? I can respect that. I can totally I respect that. I can't be mad at that. I can't. I mean, it depends okay. on who this, who they squad no, with. Got Dragonite? Right. Based that's on what the, I'm saying. based on the screenshots, Cynthia does have Mega Gardevoir. Iris okay. does have Haxorus. But okay. other than that, I don't know the other two. I don't think I've seen screenshots of the other two Pokemon they each have. Okay. But that, and then we get Ash and Steven Stone, which I think is probably going to be the best match out of all of them, honestly. Oh, that 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 fight's going to be... Yeah, that's going to be on point. Yeah, if that Ash can take Steven... Yeah, if Ash can take Steven down, he has a... I think he could beat Leon. <laughs> If he has to take on Iris again, I'll be mad because he already beat her already. Mm-hmm. And he already had to do... He took... I was watching I was watching a dub of um the Pokemon anime. I mean, he had to take on the um, fighting gym leader from Galar three times in the World Coronation to took him... He lost twice and won the last one because of... um Because he got Mega Lucario. That's where the dub's at. Like, he just got Mega oh. Lucario in the dub. That's where Netflix is at. He just got Mega Lucario. Okay. So they're not too far. They're only like, I want to say like four months behind right now. So we might That's get not these. bad at all. Yeah, they're no more than like five or six months behind. So it's not, the distance is not too bad. But they haven't announced when the next set of dub episodes coming out. But if I had to take a guess, it'd probably be right before Scarlet and Violet come out, which I'm sticking Team Scarlet right now based on rumors, but I'll leave it at that. Hmm. And I, I, Panda, did you pick what version you were gonna go with Scarlet I, or Violet? I have not yet. I'm not gonna lie. Uh, we know Vocab going with Violet because it's perfect. We already know. If that. he if he gets it, he's going Violet. Yeah, that, that's that's a given. I'm going with Scarlet just to be the opposite of Vocab. <laughs> of course. <laughs> yeah, my bad for coming in late. What, what, no, what's you good, fam. Pokemon. Pokemon. We were just talking about the new Pokemon Scarlet and uh, Violet that are coming out. Oh, word. Because they're supposed to finally have a uh, a multiplayer where you can like everybody can run through the game together type deal. Bet right. <laughs> so I I think 
I'm gonna end up as far as the Pokemon, I think I'm gonna end up going with the uh the fire type dude, to be honest. That's Fueco or something like that. I forget his name. I think I'm gonna end up going with him. Uh as far as which version, I don't know yet. I don't I don't know. I'm gonna go this um, what I do know is if they do not come to this correct, if they don't come correct with this, Doki V is still supposed to be releasing next year. So, if if Doki V comes out and it's as hard as it looks like it's gonna be, Pokemon will not have a chance if they don't come come correct. They're gonna need another Legend Arceus soon. I'll tell you a multiplayer legend of Arceus if Doki V comes out the way it's supposed to. I have, yeah, I've heard that's supposed to be good. Oh, yeah, from what, from what I've seen in the trailers and stuff, like it's like Digimon meets Pokemon. So, like, oh, hold on, ready for it. all right, okay. Yo, motherfuckers is crazy. <laughs> <laughs> we saw. <laughs> that shit is wild, bro. Look, I'm gonna fill y'all in, cause fuck it, we all family here. <laughs> yeah, you know what I'm saying? Give, give, give the the fans a little insight on our daily lives. So, <laughs> as y'all know, cause I told y'all in the chat, I was out and about last night. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, he was out and about. Right, right. So apparently, uh, Shorty got down with somebody else. Oh, nice. Boy, and. Boy. Her 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 wife caught her on 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 4K. <laughs> right. So, so I wake up. I wake up to to a voicemail. Listen, I wake up to a voicemail saying, "Fuck you, this that you don't ever come back to my house, this and that." Right, and I'm like, "What the fuck, like?" Yeah, bro. What the hell you do? I'm like, I do shit, right? So I'm thinking, I'm like, did I do something crazy? And I'm like. Oh shit! I was like, "Oh, girl was over there with them them little lesbian chicks or whatever." I wonder if she got down, and and so this bitch is trying to hold me accountable. Like, "Oh, well, you should have stopped her or whatever." Why that's really what it is, bro? Oh wow, that's really what it is. They're like, "Oh, well, you supposed to be my boy. Why didn't you stop?" I'm like, "Nigga, I was trying to get everybody to play fucking space. Everybody was paying attention to them. I'm shuffling the call." Yo, don't don't try to hold me accountable for your wife cheating on you, my nigga. Even if we friends, wow. that's not that's not my job, bro. Hey, yo, bro, I know exactly how you feel. I had a situation like that. Two of my friends was dating. This was back when I was in Korea. Two of my friends was dating, and I was really close to both of them. And when I found out the other one was fucking around with the another girl, I was like, bro, like. If you finna be doing, if you finna be doing this shit, just break up with home girl, y'all. Just break up with her. Right, you know. What I'm saying? Long story short, she got caught up, and like they blame me for it. And I'm saying like, like what do you want me to do? Like, what do you want me to do? Right. But we are all adults, bro. I'm not in charge of in this one. Like, come on, bro. That shit is wild. Anyway, wow. that shit. Like, I'm like, nah, bro. This can't be it. Anyway, we on. We on some Caribbean shit today. It's called fucking Carib Shandy. Oh, oh nice. We, we on cream soda. Right. And I got a Gatorade. Yo, that too. cream soda does sound like it's it good if, right now. If you know about the blue Gatorade, thumbs up. Oh, okay. just saying. The best soda come in, glass bottles. Hey. hey, you know that? You know what? That's you know that? Argument. I had um, what did I have earlier? Wawa Lemonade. I had that earlier. That shit busts. Wawa Lemonade busts, bro. That's that fat. was good. I, I miss it. I've written Ice cold. This big, yeah. I, yeah. I forgot how good Northeast stuff is, man. I, I've forgotten. I've been spoiled this past weekend. <laughs> so for those who don't know, Rod had took a trip back home. So he out in the East Coast right now, chilling and enjoying the vibe. So right, right. Yeah, so Vocab, we went to BBQs too, man. Went to BBQs. Woo, woo, woo. Yes, sir. <laughs> <laughs> yes, sir. Hey, man. Mm-hmm. I need Had to. to. I need to take a trip, bro. Hey, yo, question. Did anybody try out that new Battle Royale game? I can't pronounce the main name, but I call it Blade Point. Naraka Blade Point. Jay's been trying yes. to get me on that. Yeah, he's been trying to Bro, like, real talk, that shit is actually pretty lit. Like, what system is that on? It's on, it's on Xbox. Awesome. Yeah, it's on all of them. 
Like okay. I'm thinking about getting it on the on the PS5 too, just so I can play with some other people and stuff every once in a while. But so far I've been playing it on the Xbox and yo, I'm not even a fan of Battle Royale. I hate Battle Royale. I don't play I don't like Fortnite. I hate um Same. Call of Duty. I don't like none of that yeah. shit. But people always catch me on, on the Rock of Blade point. That shit is actually pretty fire, bro. Okay. Definitely have to look into that when I get back home. Definitely have to do some research on that one. So I, I think the, o- get game the only downfall to that game is if the team set only go to to maximum of three. They don't do quads. Just uh, trios. Oh, solos, duels, and uh, trios. Yeah, so, no, no quads, yo. So no four, no four, no four v four, no five v five. Oh. Nah. Yeah, you don't need it. So if mm. you ever play. It put me in my apex, but everything is not ready. Like you don't, you're not. They have guns, but they're not the go-to weapons. Right. Like you don't want to throw hands. You're gonna want the swords, the great swords, right. the wheel, the katana, and like and each weapon has a different level. The level determines how strong the weapon. is. The more you use your weapon, the weaker it gets to the point it can break. You can fix your weapon as you go, but you gotta pick up material to fix it. And then another thing about that game is you gotta be careful of the talismans you get, yo. Cause motherfuckers just be going in there grabbing everything they can. Uh-huh. Certain talismans only work with certain weapons. Like oh. they got special talismans that work with spears, dual weapon, um, daggers, uh, kuna, not kuna, but on katana, long sword. Depending on which one you get, uh, you end up you end up fucking yourself up. Uh, My bad, Duke. Sorry. <laughs> nah. So we got a new game on the If you look in the chat, uh, where you can catch Pokemon. So randomly, a Pokemon will pop up, and you you hit uh, exclamation Poke Catch, and you can catch the Pokemon. And it's like it builds up your little your group. It was a cat turn that popped in, and Vocab tried to get it, and I saw his, so I put mine in, <laughs> and I got it. They was like, nah, because they told me that I ain't start yet, so I gotta start first. Wait, yeah. what? Wait, what's the game? I, it. a, I only wanted it because it was a purple flame. I was like, if you look, it's in the it's chat. A, um, it's a game within the chat on which called Pokey Catch. And they both tried to Pokemon. <laughs> he called before Cat Catch it. <laughs> I to broke the shit first. <laughs> <laughs> and he started the game yet. Yeah, right. So he had to actually initiate it first. So yeah, if you if if you're watching and you haven't started, do exclamation poke start as you saw vocab do, and that'll activate it. You get your first Pokemon without having to catch it. It just gives you one randomly, and then after that, as they come in, you know, as those new Pokemon come in, you have a chance to catch it. So, so yeah. Um. Oh. So I want to do this one real quick, just because I feel like being an a-hole. We talked about this before. Somebody wanted to say that Frozen was like the best sister bonding movie that came out. Oh, I remember this. And they were oh, talking yeah. trash about Lilo and Stitch like, come on, bro. not doing it. Real Stitch is the is the goal. So yeah, this was the this is what it was. And New York Times had posted it up there, but they were like, we, the director was frustrated after Frozen was praised for being a sisterhood movie. It was like it was a bit frustrating because people were like, finally, a non-romantic relationship with these two girls. And I thought we did that. That was absolutely done before Frozen. And so these are some of the people's replies and stuff. There was like, now nah, Frozen just has better chemistry and blah blah blah. And everybody, you can tell. I hate to say it. The melanated individuals yeah. are all came like, out. bruh. They came out for that. <laughs> 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 You're tweaking, fam. Like, you know yeah. what? Low key, low key. I'm surprised with Kingdom Hearts, we never got a Lilo and Stitch on Worlds, but we got Frozen. Wait, what about right. Brother Bear? Oh, thank you. Thank you. You what about brother, brother Bear? Bear. <laughs> exactly. Like literally, brother Bear. Oh yeah, like you got brother Bear. Oh, you had oh, what else? Uh, hold on, Fox and the Hound. Oh yeah, that's a good. You one. You had 
if if Bambi if Bambi wasn't the original like squad, come on now, you had Bambi Thumper and Flower. They they stayed rolling together. That's right. Or even Lamb Before Time. Shoot, Lamb Before Time. Right, right. Uh, no, hold, what was it? Uh, yeah, no, Lamb Before Time. Ducky. That was one of the things with Ducky. I still say yep, yep, yep to this day. <laughs> <laughs> I randomly will say that shit. <laughs> Was like, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, nah, they need to they need to chill with that. Yeah, but yeah, 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 I guess it became a thing yeah. on, on Twitch and people were it was like, oh, this is you know the best one. Like, no, 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 no. I need y'all not to did you take your dress out, bro? No, no, no. Yeah. No. I can tell like you had a fro for me. Oh, uh, <laughs> yeah, that was that was a wild story. That was a wild story, man. Yeah, that's crazy. I was like, "What? What? What possessed y'all to to try to pull that? What will possess y'all to try to pull that?" Well, Beyonce's internet. <laughs> Beyonce's internet, right? Exactly. Oh, <laughs> um, oh! If you all are Transformer fans, Rod brought this to us earlier. Pluto TV now has a uh, all Transformers channel. And we talking about like the old school Autobots. Nice. So if you're on you know, Transformers, Transformers fans, and these guys. right, right. <laughs> so, but they got a full channel of just just Transformers now. So give that give that a look if you get a chance. Yeah, um, if you don't have if you don't have Pluto TV, download that app. You know, you don't know what they're going to immediately. You don't have guy. the whole channel on Pluto TV. Huh? Loop on the third has his own yes. channel. Yes, he Naruto does. has his own. One Piece has his own channel. Yeah, yeah. And and we soon will have one as well, but they don't know that yet. So <laughs> keep that on the hush. Hey, it's coming. Hush. It's coming. Oh, it's coming. It All right. Yeah, yeah. We it's got work. We got some work, but it's in it's in the works. Um, speaking of that, and one of the topics that will eventually be on that channel, uh, we're gonna, we're gonna talk about. Real quick, worst anime dads. We kind of spoke about this in our group earlier in the week. <laughs> um, and I put out if y'all watch uh, either my TikToks or if you watch our YouTube channel, I put up just a quick post 10 of the worst anime dads in the history of anime dads. Number one spot, I don't care who you are, always and forever will go to Shao Tucker from Full Metal Alchemist. <laughs> Legit. You, that, yeah, yeah. Like you can't, you can't just you know turn your daughter into a dog, nigga. Right. <laughs> you turn your no, daughter. No, your first daughter you turned your That's wife into Look, a dog. Facts. And facts. then you came back and turned your daughter into a dog to keep yeah. your job. This shit is crazy. Shit is crazy. But he did it for her. <laughs> really? <laughs> really? We really doing that? <laughs> So Edward, right? No, no, no. So it was funny. I was watching. Uh, I was on YouTube just looking at convention, like mashups, just seeing what the new cosplays was for the year, stuff like that. Somebody took their kid and dressed her up as the girl and the dog. Had her sit next to groups of people and just say Edward. When I say people were bawling, crying at these conventions. <laughs> I was like, dude, that is so wrong. Why? I'm calling CPS. I'm calling CPS. I'm calling CPS. <laughs> he taught his dog how to say Edward. No, he no, took he his daughter dress like and dressed dog. her like the dog from Full Metal Alchemist. <laughs> nah, it's a video on TikTok. And he said, yo, everybody in the anime community is going to hit me. Hate me no, for this. He so said, sweet see- boy. Dog looked at him and said, Edward, I was like, oh, no, no. no. Oh, my God. no. That shit. No. no, 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 there's certain things you don't cross, man. That's a line, right? That's wild, bro. <laughs> like, why would you even Open think that, up. my guy? Why? I want to know. All, I just want to know this who was the wife that let him do that to their child? <laughs> Thank you, Jumbo. My wife. Right, exactly, exactly, Rod. <laughs> she clearly had no clue what screen. he did. Put me on screen. Put me Hold screen. up, go for yeah, it. Yeah, here you go. Let's go play. 
Uh, out of play. Uh, so I am very, very sorry to everyone who gets this. I just need you to know that I am a monster. Uh, Odin, Odin, say Edward. Say Edward. Oh, he's oh, it's a husky. Oh, that's why. That's even worse, man. Yo, bro. Oh, wow. Nah, someone call animal control. I'm, bro. I'm, you know what? Hold up. I'm leaving the room myself. <laughs> I'm not you. He's so. He gone. <laughs> what happened? So today, that's some BS, man. I took myself out the room after that. <laughs> I needed a minute. Man. Well, not <laughs> so, shout out as we said, number one always. Now, the rest of these, honestly, I think they all are fighting for every other place moving forward. I will have to say Rod brought up a very interesting point. <laughs> he said Ash and Deku's dad. And I can't be mad at him for that comment. <laughs> I mean, but didn't Deku's dad die? I don't nope. remember. We don't no, know. they said he was on a business trip. That's all that was said. They just oh, never bro, came home. Oh, my God. <laughs> <laughs> he went out to go on a business trip for milk? Right. Yeah, he, he went he, for milk. He coming back with the milk, bro. He coming right. back. Oh, yeah. Oh, so I'm pretty sure he's man. enjoying the milk. Yeah. My son will have a quirk. I'll get some milk. I'll be back. <laughs> right. He coming. He coming back to that, with that milk, bro. Like, I, I can't even argue. Ash has been 10 for, what, 20 years now? No, and the man like, still you know, ain't came back. 20 years. We all know what happened, though. What he's a saying? Like, I no. still stand by that. Mm-hmm. I stand a- by the fact a- that Ash is a saying. Oh, this is a dream. It's a dream. <laughs> Thanks. Think about the first episode. We ho ho on um, steps. We ho yeah. little thing. He's ho ho. Yeah. That's a good theory. That would be I mean, really messed up. I'm not going to lie. I He's would say maybe home. pre-Gen 5, that was probably the running theory. I'm, I guess it was Gen 5, like a soft, soft reboot, so probably not. But that's just my own theory. But I think with Masters and everything, I mean, shoot, speaking of, I mean, I know we were talking about Ash a few moments ago. I mean, that boy Ash is a Pokemon Masters EX. So I think that's a sign Ash is almost wrapped. His story is almost over. So you know, people are, yeah. The man is his oldest person have a dream when they always lose. I mean, he'll win until, like, what, season nine? <laughs> I mean, he had that falling down the stairs dream. <laughs> I mean, I mean, what they do like about the admin, at least they're acknowledging he's a regional champion, finally. So, to, to get yeah. into the master era. I mean, I give him, it's just, I, I, that man deserves so much more credit. Like, At, we can be honest, Asgard, Robin, Kalos, and Sinnoh, I'll, I'll die on that hoe. I'll die on Ash been robbed of everything, everything. <laughs> like, yeah. There's if he okay. Here's my first. Here's my question, and I'm not as versus Rod in this one. So, but this is just my little heel when it comes to Pokemon. I'm an original 151 man. Like, I like some of the new ones, yes, but I am a diehard original 151. Right. Okay. Ash's first. 10 Pokemon, had he kept all of them, would wipe the floor with everybody because none of them were like the regular stats for the creatures that they were. None of them were. No lie. I, I, I'm, 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 I'm surprised he's not using Charizard or Master Aids. I'm, I'm, I'm still shocked. That's all I'm saying. Charizard, I'm Charmander, and all of them practice with Pikachu. First and foremost, <laughs> for how long? Like they had I mean, Butterfree, they let Butterfree go. Squirtle was the captain of the Squirtle squad. Hey, hey whoa, squad. whoa, 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 whoa! Butterfree yeah. had some ass he had to chase. I give him that. I give him that, and he did come back eventually. But <laughs> you can't tell me Butterfree wasn't hardcore. That's the only. Me- <laughs> he said no cap. <laughs> <laughs> no. No. Prime but went to be a, but be a wrestling said, champion. Fuck Ash catch right. and ass chasing. <laughs> right. Thanks. He said Prime went to go fight. He he had the tournament that he went to. Uh, who else did let, he have? Had let Pidgeot go. Pidgeot left. Pidgeot gone. 
Bulbasaur stayed in the garden. I'll be on 60 Toros. Hey, there's a Teddy Ursa in the, in the chat, y'all. I don't know who like Teddy Ursa. I don't know. That would be another good cosplay for you, Panda, the evolved form of that. Ursa, are you trying to go? I don't like Teddy Ursa Major. Like, uh, Ursa Major, I don't know. He just looked He looked like a castle and a bear combined. Wait, you talking about Ursa sense. Ring or you talking about Ursa, Ursa Luna? Ursa Ring. Teddy Ursa is the first evolved form. Okay, not the um, not the one in Legend Arceus. All right. No, 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 not that one. Yeah, no, he just looks like he should be a castle as a brown band. I don't know. What's up, Cloud? Yeah, but most people like Ursaring because of Paul in the anime because he. Uh, he okay, okay. He putting some. He was putting in the work with Ursaring. I was like, even I had to go I back and like. That. I was like, wait a minute, Paul putting in the work with him. I was like, oh wait a minute, that's like not bad Pokemon. Mm -hmm. Nah, yeah, I can Hello. see, that. I can see that. I don't know. See, see, I always thought Pangaro. Oh. I prefer Pangaro to Ursaring. No, I can respect that. You know. Well, or, wait, I think Ursa was a panda that. too. Now that I think about it, I think Ursa was kind of like a panda too. Who? I think Ursa was an Ursa. Hold on. For those who don't know who we're talking about, I'm gonna pull it up for y'all. Go ahead and keep going, Rob. Okay, yeah, because they're Pangoro. I know we were talking about that before the show, and then I think Urshifu, the new cub bear, I think his evolved form is kind of like a panda, too. Let's see here. Whoa. That's Pangoro. For those yeah, who that's Pangoro. Oh, yeah. Most definitely cosplay him. Like, I was like, I need to get like a, ta a tux with tails, you know what I mean? <laughs> to, to pull that one off. And then oh. get the bamboo stripe too. That would be that'd be dope. Oh yeah. Oh, you and know, that, have you been, I've looked at some of these like megas that people have been doing? We both catch one Pokemon. Like this one here. Hey, I thought I would a tip pig. Hey, let's go. That this was hard, key. but it's Group a fake key. one. Oh, that's a grass monkey? Pokemon. He's from Sword and Shield. There you go. He's he's a monkey. He's a monkey. He's a there grass he monkey. Ah, uh, okay. That and that's what he turns them. into. Yeah, his final evolved form is he's straight a brother. He's a roster. Look at the hair. He dreaded and everything. His final form is he, he becomes a gorilla with a drum. He's yeah. black. Oh, he's yeah. Completely. Hey, I ain't gonna lie. My favorite Pokemon had to be Cub Fu, yo. Cub Fu went hard, yo. That's exactly that's the pre-evolved form of Urchitu. That's exactly what I'm talking about. There you go. Are you talking about him? Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Yeah, I can mm -hmm. see Panda cosplaying him. Maybe the Urchitu. I can see that. I can see that. I just hear. I'd have to get a gray full body suit, and then get like a, like one of those hooded things that like drape down. What well, that they have in church? You know what I'm talking about? The choir oh, always yeah. wear. Choir road always wears them. <laughs> hey yo, if I cosplay anybody, my very first cosplay will have to be Static Shock. I'm so I can see that. I can see that. That's literally part of the reason why. That's part of the reason. That's I can see it. I can see it. Hey, I probably do casual Vegeta. I probably do casual Vegeta from Super. Pink shirt, bad. <laughs> nah, I ain't no pink shirt. I ain't Cameron. Nah. <laughs> you know what? I was about to care for. I never you did that. I'm not Cameron. <laughs> Kill a cam. I bit a bam. Blit a blam. Okay, hold up. But I gotta say this. I have to say this. On that note with Cameron, you have to admit when he walked into that uh that award ceremony with that pink that pink jacket, everybody was like. That's actually kind of hard. <laughs> like oh, it worked. It worked. Yeah, like he went to the Hall of Fame for that too. You talking about the pink chiller? Yeah, yep. yeah. The pink chiller. Oh the yeah. Pink chiller was crazy. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie. Pink chiller was crazy. Cloud, he said, Can I start over? <laughs> no, no, no. You can't start over. I mean, I don't know. You might be able to start over, but I don't think you can start over. Try but it. you can catch other Pokemon. And <laughs> man said pop Leo hey, now. And I'm good on that. There you go. That's Pop Leo. That's the full evolution yeah. round of it. Okay. Yeah, it, it's not the best. I know a lot. It, that was a very controversial one right there. <laughs> he said oh, you I, already I, have I a thought it was with Cyndaquil. Oh, Cyndaquil. Yeah, cool. yeah, you yeah, already yeah, have a pass. Yeah, yeah, Sorry, yeah, bro. You only get one start. You only get one. You only get one. I started with Charmander, so I was happy. I'm not going to lie. I'm not, I'm not. I'm not opposed to Cyndaquil. You know? Oh, Cyndaquil was a go was a goat. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Especially in Legend of he got that um <laughs> ancient. <laughs> Especially... <laughs> no, one guy might like a suing um Typhlosion. Show that one, Panda, if you can. He oh, might Typhlosion? like it. 
<laughs> yeah, the the Hisuian <laughs> form from Legend Arceus. Yeah. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Do, 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 do. Here we go with the purple and top red. Like, Here you go. I, I rock, rock top lotion. But I think the, that the, the Hisui version with the purple I, and red. I, 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 okay. Yeah, I, I, I can see Vocab rocking that. Hell Rock yeah, the... fire. Yeah. Literally purple fire. Typhlosion. See, there you go. See, Typhlosion go. go hard, but. Oh, yeah, definitely. That's, that that gin, I had to go with Trico. Trico, that dude. <laughs> Trico it. is on point. <laughs> Just the, the design. Only time I did not start with a fire type Pokemon. The only time. Yeah, Trico, Trico, especially in the anime, Trico was pretty much just a Vegeta. He was oh, pretty yeah, much Vegeta. Yeah. Had, had a little two pit. There you go. Yep. He was pretty much Vegeta. Attack. Like I always oh, like Trico, Trico because of the anime. Because as just Trico, Septile, that thing was a gangster. Oh, uh, see, and that's another one that Ash had. That's that's what I'm saying. Like the man was raising legends, <laughs> and then just let him go. <laughs> like if everybody Ninja. came back for a reunion tour, he would go and literally wipe the floor with everybody. Mewtwo ended up on his side. Let's just be honest here. But then again, he, he wanted the smoke. Ash Ash got the smoke with Mewtwo. Ash so wanted like... all that smoke. He wanted all that smoke. Um, hey, okay, hold on. We, can we agree that Ash is a stand out of your sand because he be holding Pokemon? I said that earlier. I said that earlier. Yeah, it's funny enough. I mean, they had the um anime episode. I'm not sure if you guys knew, but um, Paul came back for an episode too, and even him and Chim and Inferno kind of made up a little bit. So, oh wow, they just get that like, like I, I want to respect on Gary. respect. Pete Gary versus Paul. That's what I want. Oh, Paul P. Gary will work the foot. No, you know what? I'm lying. That might be a good, that might be a closer fight than we think, honestly. Pete Gary versus who? Paul. I think Gary would wipe the floor with him. It depends on the Pokemon, Pokemon. too. It, it depends, depends on, on who you pull in. If we pull in like the, his original. Because I can see Gary with like Blastoise, Umbreon, and Arcanine probably. Paul will probably have like. Oh, he's keeping Arcanine definitely. Right, your TV scared the hell out of me, bro. I thought it was something. Real, <laughs> oh, let me move my angle a little bit. I don't know. It scared the hell out of me. I was like, oh, this nigga is dead. <laughs> <laughs> my ass wasn't going to say a word. I didn't go. So. <laughs> I didn't see it. I wasn't let there. My... Let me move over a little bit. All right, that should work. <laughs> that should work. No, yeah, but um, but Paul and um, Inferno made up. When he came back for the anime episode, and funny enough, Paul's a gym leader now. They didn't say what regions he he's a gym leader in, but that would be a gym I would love. I would want to challenge. So That'd here's a question: What if they put him in Scarlet or Violet? Because they don't say where he's at. That's a good point. That's See what I'm saying? He getting work. That's what's gonna happen. We're gonna jump. Oh, you are gonna get some work? <laughs> he's gonna make you work That's, for that yeah. badge. Paul, he probably be, he probably be just as Paul. bad as um he probably be just as bad as um um who um Ryan from Sword and Shield the eight gym leader he probably has some oh, yeah. he have like a special gimmick with a certain this type. dude right here that's, that's what we're talking about player. yeah Vogue probably cosplay as Paul <laughs> <laughs> with the type he, purple, he does rock purple on the regular that nigga was an asshole I remember him. Yeah. <laughs> He said, wait a minute. <laughs> that nigga was an yeah, asshole. Was gym leader, bro. Look, who, what was that person he, he had when he kicked out his team? He was like, man, get the hell out of here. <laughs> That's yeah, no man. joke. Like, he would get, yeah. get the hell out of here. You ain't strong enough now. <laughs> yeah, Paul yeah. Paul became a gym leader. They didn't say which region, but he's a gym leader now. I thought yeah. he ended up being a frontier brain, honestly. like They didn't say if he beat Brandon or not. They didn't say that, unfortunately. I was hoping to get some resolution for that one. Paul has some issues, bro. Yeah, him and but he mellowed out. Was not not a good look, though. I'm not gonna lie. They they did they did damage. Yeah, Lokel is like, yeah, that Pokemon like he'll be on my team. The Scorpion. Well, you know what it is. <laughs> the Scorpion. Shoot. Mm -hmm. I think look, Volk can have a team of niche with po purple Pokemon. Purple Pokemon. That's what gonna be. You can pull it off too. That's, that's all it's gonna be. Hold on. Let's do this. Let's look up purple Pokemon. Oh, hey, that was just a fun man. Gasly. That right. You got Gasly. You can't have Gengar. Ditto. Why can't get Gengar? 
That's my favorite Pokemon, hands down. Nigga, fuck it. Yeah, he's purple. What's your favorite Pokemon? It's a thousand of them. You you could use that motherfucker. Mewtwo is purple. (laughs) Espeon, Grimer, Ekans. Yeah. Now I want a fucking Ekans. I'm good on that. Venonat, Shelter. Survivor. either. Oh, True, Nidoking. King. I always like Nidoking, King, but yeah, he's good. Like that's a very underrated Pokemon. That's he, a very he, under- what the fuck is that purple dragon right there? Go back up. Is oh. that the Gallo? No, go back up. Go back up. Uh, that right there. Is that a fucking purple Charizard? It is a purple Charizard. <laughs> <laughs> no, said, you know I'm what? No, that was Charizard's original signing in gold and silver. It was purple. Yeah, I was, Garchomp saying, too. I was like, no, nah, go check. Forgot about Garchomp. Charizard right there. Garchomp, yeah. Yep. Don't okay, we'll definitely have a mega. This is shit kind of fire purple Pokemon, bro. There's plenty of them. Yeah. Right. Haunter, I'm sorry, Weezing. Haunter and Gengar, when I, they are completely, completely underrated. Gengar got, nerf, got nerfed a little bit um because it doesn't have Levitate anymore. But Yeah, he did. He did. Paul Bro, Bushy man. Brown having this need to go somewhere. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, toxic. No, I can see Vocab with toxic packs. I can see him with toxic. Oh, packs. toxic. Yeah, definitely. Ah shit. He probably like if I, if I can think of a team Vocab, it'd probably be like he probably do something with poison. I can see him send them like a poison team. Yeah. Poison ghost or poison yeah. burn. Like, like he'll just be burning and poisoning people. So he probably yeah. would have Hasuian Cyplosion. He probably have he probably would have Ekans. Ekans has um poison gas. I can see mm-hmm. him with Drapion. I can see him. Look how many purple shiny Pokemon. I know there's purple well, shiny. You think about this. Hey, is there any purple legendary Pokemon? Yes, there is. There's like this two. one of my god. Yeah. Let me get let me get that motherfucker right there. Uh, the, uh, I mean, I what, whatever the god Pokemon. He's purple. He's a purple dragon. Yeah. See, there you go. Just give me all the purple dragons. Man. Oh yeah, Pokia too. Yep, that's another legendary that's purple. See, there you go. Just give me all the. All the purple legendaries. I want a Cinderella. For some reason, I want a Cinderella. That that motherfucker roof was on Smash Bros. <laughs> oh Cinderella. yeah, yeah. Say say less. Say less. Espeon, true. Klaus is like Espeon. Espeon is yeah. Gudra, true. That is a good true, choice. True, true. That was another one. Ash had and let that run away too. That's another right. one he had and let one. And then, depending on how how like how bluish you want the purple to go. I mean, half the blue Pokemon looked purple, so or half their shinies are purple too. Right, they gotta be like actual purple, not not. Blue. Oh wait, Vogel would definitely have Crobat. He probably would definitely oh, yeah. have Crobat because he's fast. He can poison. Depends yeah. on who he wants. So his... there we go, purple. For those who didn't know, there are plenty of purple Pokemon. So go out there, build your purple team, and then leave it in the comments. Let us know what you think. Yeah, and I might or pick a poke, or any Pokemon and try to do a color scheme with it. That's what I did when do I beat. Color scheme. That's what I did no. when I beat um Sword and Shield for the first time. I did. Right. I did in we front. Do that. We should do yeah. that with our Chaos Emeralds. What with the um, Pokemon or just yeah? Like... We could do a color scheme with our Chaos Emeralds. Oh, that might work. Yeah. If it's a Pokemon Digimon that are that. T- Ooh, that's a good. Uh huh. Oh, Digimon? Let's try Digimon. Let's do it. Purple Digimon? Oh. Purple Digimon. Let's do it. Oh, that's a good one. Hey, why not? We're already on the su- on the subject here. Mm. Hey, right. Impmon Purple. Impmon. <laughs> yep. Hey, hey, hey. Hey, 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 hey. hey. Which means how hold, hold so do you get the evolution if they're not purple? I mean, if they were already purple, it's all right. All right. So cause Impmon is purple. No. No, <laughs> no, Jay's no, like no. no. That nigga don't want me get but you can't have purple, fam. Like you not on the purple squad, remember? Yeah, you not. I, 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 black, but he ain't black. He purple. We not talking about his soul. We talking about his color. His color, We talking about his color, not his soul. I guess I'll just get red. That, I ain't go for it. Growl mine. Oh yeah, oh, ooh, yeah. That's a good one. Grandma, bro, when grandma came, bro, I like, I can make my own. Did you mind? <laughs> See here, who, uh... That was such a cool. Oh wait, what about um? That was from um Frontier. I think he was born. What was it, Kendomon or something like that? Um, oh man, Kendomon was one. <laughs> they had the Kendos. I can't think of the character name. That's 
Pokemon. Yeah, no, stop. Yeah, man, no, man. Need purple. Need purple. Pokemon. That was no. he was he was actually pretty decent. Pokemon. Oh yeah. I forget his evolution though. You late, vocab. <laughs> All right. That was gonna be a little more. Like as soon as I looked at it, all I saw was catch. I was like, damn. <laughs> Yeah, did die. Uh, uh, Jumbo beat us to it. I still uh, put shit out there anyway. Well, it's still at a, it's still at a, it's still a um a randomization, so you don't know who gonna get it. I'm gonna I'm gonna put another one in there. <laughs> <laughs> you know what? Why not? I'll go ahead. And try you might as well jump in there, bro. Uh, all, right, see okay, okay. all right, let's see who gets it. Let's see who gets it. What's the Pokemon? I'm on, I don't even know what Pokemon it is. I don't know either. Sprinty. Sprinty. Oh, it's no. It's purple, too. <laughs> no, it's hey, pink. It is purple. It's pink. I mean, no, it's pink. It's pink. It's pink. Oh. There we go. I think you're thinking of, um, yeah, Sprinty's pink. There you even go. Shiny's purple. I don't know. Uh, her evolved form is purple and pink. Okay. Good shit. We got some yeah. That's right. The um, the gym leader um, spritz it. Yeah, the pink, yeah, the um, fairy type gym leader was obsessed with the color pink. I just remember mm-hmm. that. Super obsessed. She didn't even want to fight Ash because he didn't want to pink wear. I because he wasn't wearing pink or something like that. I forgot. Oh, wow. It was like that in the games too. She picked someone just because they were wearing an all pink outfit too. That that was hilarious. Uh, caught by everybody. <laughs> Everybody except for Jumbo, and he oh, except yeah. for Jumbo. <laughs> <laughs> he was the first one. <laughs> Sorry, bro. Sorry. Yo, no, he they called, always find a way to called. rob the Uchihas, bro. No, he they he always find a way to rob the. Uchihas. Hold on, hold on. Let me see. It says vocal. Oops. No, vocal. The and then they and said pandemonium. Yeah. Hold on. Let me pull your. Let me pull your screen up, Jay. Go back. Let me see. It says right there. Yep, I see it too. Oh, okay. It didn't show for the rest of us though. Oh yeah, it didn't show. It didn't show on ours. It says Spree has been caught by vocal dude, infamous and panda. Right. Right. We talking about Jumbo. Though. Jumbo. <laughs> Jumbo was the first one to to, to put it on there. Yeah, yeah. Oh, he, he didn't need it. He did. He didn't need wow. it. Wow! Wow! It only be That's me. Chihas, bro. <laughs> it be your own, as they said. But while we're on this um Pokemon subject, at Panda, um, we should let them know who's coming to on um, Pokemon Unite pretty soon. Oh, while we're on this I Pokemon. think I've got a. Well, I've got the old stuff. I figured you'd want to bring it up. The last update that was on six twenty. Uh, for the buffs, I did grab that image for you. Yeah, we got some. Yeah, we don't like my nose all up in there. <laughs> yeah, because we got we got we got a, we got a, we got another pseudo coming to the game soon. So there you all go, really, bro. I'm Sorry, here, people, man. Poor Charles, he got he got nerfed boy, back. Slowpoke, he put this together. They put that together. They put this together for us. Well, not for us, but they put it together and we grabbed it because we thought it was actually really good. So shout out. Yes, hey, I was playing with Snorlax the other day. I didn't know he got buffed that good. Mammo, yeah, I his definitely... buffs went up, up. Yeah, Mammo, oh, yeah. got good. Snorlax is good, but we got, mm-hmm. we got. I think coming out in a couple of days, we got Glaceon joining the battle pretty soon. Glaceon is going to be joining the battle, and then uh, for oh. August, and then for August, we got we've been Tyranitars coming in August, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls. What are they Tyranitars? Putting them at? The you rumor know? is all rounder. Rumor is all rounder. Okay, okay, okay. Like guard, because I was like, like guard champ. That makes sense. I thought he'd be more of a defensive attacker, but okay. When I'm being a rock type, I was thinking maybe a more hybrid of defense and attack. But mm, nah, nah. I definitely would say I would definitely say let him let him rock out as an all rounder. It makes sense. I mean, th- that is defense and attack together. That that's basically an all rounder. You know, um, right. But no, he's gonna have. What a Steve! You told me about yeah. was it Buzz? I forget his name. Buzz. Uh, oh yeah, that's coming soon. Yeah, that's coming soon too. Buzz. Wall. I think that's also August. I think that's also August too. Hold up, let me show y'all what this man looks like. I had never seen this Pokemon before, right? Yeah, he's an Ultra Beast. He's an Ultra Beast. Look at this dude. Is that a mosquito? Is that Larry Lobster? Look at him. Nigga, that looks like a mosquito. What armor? 
Yeah. It's a buff ass mosquito. I don't like it. I don't like it. When I'm I say scared. he go, when I watch Yo, the gameplay, yeah, buff ass mosquito. Nigga, I'm scared. Buff ass mosquito. Hold on, let me see if I can find some of the gameplay. Yeah. Going in. Yeah, it's Glaceon, Buzzwall, then Tyranitar. That's the that's the order. So y'all can kind of get an idea, kind of see. Man, both worlds gonna cause some problems. Hey, what yes. do you want to talk about? Mind Look at how fast he took dude out. He, he, he that's a Venusaur, mind you. Together. Right. Like, the, and that's not even with his super. Gangster ass mosquito, bro. That's what he, he remember how I don't. Okay, hold on. Hey. I don't know about y'all. I used to talk about mosquitoes in the south knocking you over and taking your wallet because that's what they do. That was him. They do that. That was him and his cousins. Yeah. Figured it out. I know why that mosquito so strong. That's the mosquito big Goku. There. I knew it. I knew it. (laughs) Don't know. know. Because you know he hate. You know he hate needles. So. (laughs) That was said before they. Yeah, Buzz Wolf's gonna be. I can, I can, de- like, I definitely see that. Of- he ain't even picking up points. He says it's a Florida mosquito. Exactly. He not even picking up the points. He leaving it for everybody else. <laughs> but I know who I've been. You know what I mean? That takes longer. Look at that. Give him the attack boost. Give him X attack. That thing's gonna. X attack that- is over. Or that X thing's slow. gonna. Fall. Or even X speed if you want to be. It's gonna be fancy. Be well, I'm, yeah, X speed for him or X slow for everything around him. If you slow them down, it's a wrap too. Like I've been learning Doe Fox, and I'm getting pretty. I've won a couple of rank matches with Doe Fox. Because uh-huh. if you learn, if you learn how to use Fire Spin, Doe Fox is problems. You can sit, you can sit your team oh, up. Yeah, yeah. That's like Doe Fox. The, doesn't Charizard have an attack similar to that? Yeah, but Doe Fox is it better? It's better. Okay, okay, okay. Doe Fox is like a fire Bulbasaur, but not as oh, tinky. Wow. Yeah, Glaceon's gonna be problem. Got, like, did he just heal himself? He might have. I don't know. I couldn't he tell. He just healed himself because he's got the eject button. Leech life. He's got leech life. Oh no, they gave him leech life. Oh no. Oh, that and thing that's go- one of the ones that can be elevated. Oh, um, people thought Crustle was a problem. Oh god. This is gonna be a whole. Yeah, that's gonna be a whole issue. Anyway. Buzzwell and Crustle in a lane, that's going to be problems. On the that's same be- lane? Oh, yeah. They can, have, oh. they can hold an entire area by themselves. Yeah, I wouldn't be surprised you see teams up. Uh, and I think this is going to probably be the meta, end up being the meta. It's going to probably be top. You might have a team of Buzzwall, Glaceon, Mamoswine. Um, hold on, let me think of the five. Glaceon, Buzzwall, Mamoswine, mosquitoes, bro. Um, Crustle, not, and shoot, somebody else has um Leech Life. I can't think of it right now off the top of my head. But you want to see those four Pokemon again? I think no, he's got plenty. No, yeah, Giga Drain. Yeah, Giga Drain. Yeah, Giga Drain. Hey, you know, I got an off topic question. Oh, any hmm. Xenoverse fans? Y'all Xenoverse fans? I play. I've heard of it. I've watched videos. It's cool. I haven't gotten into it. But it's I, cool. heard, I, think, yet. I heard that they're doing another, um, you know, a, another DLC update sometime this month or next month or some shit like that. And I just wanted to know if anybody heard of that shit. Huh. Not they really should. Good. They really need to just. They should have just made two new games by now already. With Xenoverse. <laughs> see, that's the thing. The game is doing so good. Nobody's gonna want to restart. I ain't played Xenoverse and don't want to. Xenoverse is in the same situation Mario Kart 8 is. <laughs> no, you know what? That reminds me. No, I got. I still got to upgrade. I still got to upgrade to get the um the the new the um the DLC tracks. I forgot. I just remembered that. We talking about Mario Kart 8. Mario Kart 8. We ain't say nothing about Smash Bros. yet. Smash Bros. is done, bro. <laughs> what was that? Uh, Smash? No, he tried. He tried. He tried. He's still trying to get on. <laughs> he got his Goku going on. Yeah, right. That's why I was like, that was that, that was that bounce. <laughs> yeah, but we're talking about old hey, school. I heard you were strong. <laughs> right, right. I heard you were strong. Oh boy, Goku always getting himself into trouble over that. Bro, no, he gave his whole universe into some goddamn trouble, yo. Bro, 
Okay, Jake I wanna, so, alone, he almost got that shit destroyed what three times. So back to the conversation we were having originally about horrible dads. <laughs> oh yeah, we we just segued all the way. <laughs> that that segued right back into it. Goku, I have to say this, and yeah, y'all can fight me. I don't put Goku on the list. Okay. Okay. Yes, I, I agree. He's a bad dad, but he's not top ten horrible. <laughs> Like, Goku's one of those, he don't understand the social cues. That's it. Yes, that's it. And he's normally off doing so. Like, you know where Goku is the entire time. You know what I training. mean? Like, he's training. He's doing something specific. Wait, wait, wait. He's either training or he's eating. Or, or dead. Or sleeping. Or sleeping. Dead. Which means he's but, doing but all he, three. He's, 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 he's doing all three. <laughs> right. Like, remember when, I don't know if y'all remember the Dragon Ball Super episode where Bolo was born, and Vegeta was like, I still can't believe you're not, you're married. <laughs> I was like, Vegeta, you're right. speaking for us all. Like, we all can't believe that Chi Chi married him. Like, and I mean, I, how do you have kids without ever kissing Chi Chi? We gonna leave that alone. There's too many <laughs> fan mangas and theories about that one. I like to go with the two four star <laughs> version of that. Put it off the camera. <laughs> I like to go go with the Team Four Star theory with a lot of that. Just to be honest. Listen, if we find out why I teach you, we get an eight charge real quick. Real quick. <laughs> yeah, we man, we only that one. <laughs> what, honey, who sent that clip where Goku transmissioned into Bulma's room middle of the night? Oh, that was me. That was that had to be me. Yeah, that was you, Rod. <laughs> that that like, was funny. You. That was funny. That was Come funny. on now. He he about your saggy titty. <laughs> That's a classic. He knew. Not to Say mention, I'm sorry. Chi 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 is bad. Well, Boma's bad. Better. I can't. I can't say that. I can't say that. You got to remember, she's not human. Chi Chi ain't human. And yeah. is the bad. No, her dad's the Ox King. What That's why Gohan's as strong as he is. Chi 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 got the same thing that Bo got. Right. Pretty much. Right. Chi Chi's nah, a giant, basically. Yeah, Chi. Yeah, but the thing with Goku is like that whole episode was funny. That that the was funny. Said, what did I walk in on? <laughs> No, that episode was funny with um because that's I think it was after they came back from the um from um the Universe Six tournament. So uh-huh. Goku when he did the Kaioken times twenty for the first time. Right. And that's when Goku did the Kaioken times twenty for the first time with Super Saiyan Blue. Mm-hmm. And his 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 um cheese his, his cheese system was all over the place. That's how he ended he was trying to go to King Kai's and he ended up at Bulma's. Yep. I was like and Goku but, was like um, the topic that we're on trail, we're talking about the worst dad in anime and we're like Goku don't make the top ten. He's a no. not a great father, but he's not top ten. Yeah, he's not top ten horrible. So oh, yeah, no. number one is um, Tucker from Full Metal Alchemist. Always, that. always and forever. Who's number two? Twice. We haven't got number two yet. Well, we don't um, have Goku on the list. We were just saying Goku's not on the list. I'm gonna, I'm, I'm gonna put up there for a number two. Uh, honestly, third Hokage. You know what? I'm no, no argument here. <laughs> No argument, no. especially if you watch Naruto no, Filler. No, no. Nope. <laughs> I was gonna say Gone's father. I was gonna say Gone. I can put that. Gone. I can put like, Gang in there. He literally made he, this song. I feel that. I can't argue that. I can't. The only other one I would switch it with is uh, Gendo from uh, Evangelion. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, like everybody else is fighting for number two and beyond. Like I'm just gonna be honest. <laughs> it's just they're horrible. Yeah, um, I know we had the argument about Endeavor. I know we were talking so, about Endeavor okay, too. Okay, go ahead and state your piece on that one, and then we're gonna have this out. Cause yeah, I don't think Endeavor deserves to be on the worst fathers list anymore. If you've been keeping up with the manga, and where the manga going? He, I didn't read the manga this week, so I don't know what happened yet. Okay, so you've heard. It. No, but no, I know, I, you're good. You're good. You got more on the manga than I do. Yeah, that's, my that's, only that's, reason, and if you can refute, if you can refute what I'm about to say, then I'll let it go. Okay. My only reason I put Endeavor on the list 
is because okay during our conversation you were like it's the same as goku and i was like only reason i say it's different than goku endeavor was trying to breed a warrior no matter what the cause was and no matter what happened to the other kids in said process and so yes eventually do i think he becomes a better father yes I don't think he become a better father, just a better human being, a better person, right? No, I can see that um, argument. But I mean, if so, I guess I'll say this: if we're going off the full series, then no, he doesn't believe he doesn't not belong on the list. I will, I will agree to that. If we're going off just what we've seen in the anime so far, yeah, we're just going mm-hmm. anime only at this point. And I, I, I will respect that. Season <laughs> six, we'll we'll change hey, that. I respect that. I respect that. Okay, okay. I do what mention. Sure. The only reason this person is not on this list because it's not anime. And that's fine with Ozai. Ozai? You know what? I can respect that. I, I don't hold on. Why? I don't I don't uh, even I don't see why. Why? Why what? Why would you put Ozai on the list as worst dads? He's Have you watched Avatar? So it's face. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Wait a first minute. Off. You know what? You know what, Jay? He did the same thing that Ooh, do we want to go to a little bit of a semi my hero academia spoiler? Here, Is that but... he he did he that's what endeavor he, did. He, he, <laughs> actually no his mother yeah, that was his mother his, his mother mom did, that. did it yeah, yeah it, um what you call it mama did that yeah and yeah, mama did that the mom did that with scalding water yo he manipulated his son <laughs> he he pretty much tortured his son bro like don't come back to written avatar know it think about it like this. He told his man to find the Avatar when the Avatar hadn't been seen for over a hundred years. You pretty much sent your son on a suicide mission. Okay. And told him not to come back. But in that in that regard, then, then would you also put Killer was dead on the list? Not no, sure. not really. I wouldn't. Yeah. Little dad, little dad actually had his back every once in a while. Yeah. Okay, I'll give you that. Like they had, they had that agreement. He was like, "Hey, yo, son, the family I understand why you're doing this. If you really gotta do this, yo, then do what you need to do." Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I'll give you that. Now, Gong's father, Gong's father. Wait, since since one man in one piece, I gotta put Sanji's dad in there. I oh, I heard about Sanji's dad. Oh, I heard about that. On the list, judges. I heard about Sanji's dad. But see, this is why I brought up Deku's dad instead of Endeavor. We were going to use someone from my hero. That's why I brought up Deku's dad because considering yeah. everything Deku's been through, and remember, my hero was all that's taking place in less than maybe a little over a year. Think about it. Yeah. All that stuff yeah. happened, and you ain't checked on your kid once. Once. Yo, that man found his son to have a crook. Like, I got to go. <laughs> I got to go. The Zoldek family is goaded. They get a pass. I, I'm with you, Trill. I, I give Your you Deku that. Deku's mom's quirk. Deku's mom. She has um, yeah, she yeah. does. She has telekinesis. She's okay, very limited yeah. telekinesis. But and his dad's gonna pop up. up. He bet his dad's gonna pop up. What? He knew. He knew his um, son wasn't gonna have nothing. He coming back with the milky cigarettes, bro. <laughs> I think they said Deku dad has like a fire type quirk. I remember hearing that somewhere either in the anime or the oh, manga. God, Endeavor. <laughs> right, Endeavor. That, that, endeavor, endeavor, endeavor. 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 that would be horrible. That would That'd be, be horrible. Tell is this nigga's brother. Okay, so there's one other one where I, I do want to bring up, and that's the monster, Yujiro Hanma. If you didn't bring him up, he would have been top. But the fact of the matter is, he just evil. He's the worst. He's he right. Evil. He actually trained his son. Let's just be yeah, honest. Like, so I, I need somebody strong to fight, so I have a kid to fight me. To fight me, he pulled a Goku. Right, much. Goku specifically said, "Yeah, I keep forgetting you're the only one that can keep up with me." Talking to go on, if, if like, we gonna put, um, if we gonna put the ogre on there, right with him, I gotta put Bojis there, bro. Oh yeah, he gotta go. But hold up, Trail said this is funny. When you realize your son is average, so you go get milk. <laughs> That's horrible. That is horrible, but real, but real. That is horrible. I got you. I got. He needs some milk. <laughs> <laughs> hey, yo, find out his son ain't got no cork. He go. He go like, 
Yeah, he's gonna need a lot of milk. I'll be right back. I'll be right back. I'm gonna get, I, I'm gonna get a towel. <laughs> yeah, I man. If you think about it, if if Deku's mom has telekinesis <laughs> and his so father has a fire, greatness. so you start having a relationship. <laughs> no, but think about this. I mean, if anything, Deku should have had a pyrokinetic power or something like that. Have it would have. And see, that's going to be funny. Like, I know you, you're farther, so you know more about what's currently in there, but it would be hilarious if that pops up later. You know what I mean? Like, if he passes it on and that ends up popping up. Yeah, I mean, interestingly enough, there hasn't been anyone with a pyrokinetic quirk yet in the series. No one's had that that has a, had a fire psychic type power yet? No, they haven't. The rumor is that maybe the second wielder might have a because he the second user of one ball has not revealed what his quirk is. We as of the model, we know everybody's quirk that's in one ball, one ball except the second user, and he's always said, "I don't think Deku can use it based on how powerful." Because it's it's a multiply, everything's multiplied stronger than what it was. So it's like a oh. time, so it's like a time seven boost. I have a question. So Why like is one for all? I know all for one, he takes everybody's quirk. Right. Why for one for all does it just, you know, inherit everybody else's quirk on down? He does. He does. He like, does. He does. does. He does, yeah. yeah. I thought yeah, he was on the fucking strength. Uh-uh. No, no, no. No, no, no. Where are you in the anime? Pretty like I literally got to the part where he just beat that dude with that long ass mask. Okay. You guys, yeah, yeah, you guys. You're some like time. season three. You're like season three. If I'm yeah, you got some time. Yeah, I'm far behind. What? What? what just keep watching, bro. Yeah, it'll you'll get the you. origin. You'll get a little bit of the quirk origin about one for all, all for one. Wait, actually, I am a little bit further because like it was just getting to the part when he was like having them fucked up dreams and shit. That's, you're the, no, you're that's the, what it is. You're right there. You're right there. You're right there. You're, right you're, right there. Right there. you're literally you're right, right, there. right there. That's yeah. what the dreams are for. Yeah. yeah. Oh, the Jumbo said Gar's dad needs to go on the list. You know what? Yeah. That's a that's a perfect. <laughs> that's a point. That's, that is a good one. Oh, yeah. uh, I definitely will give that's you that. Yeah. Gar's dad. I agree. I got that was an interesting one. Gar messed him. <laughs> That was interesting when 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 he met when Gar met his dad Edward Tinsley. That was a very interesting exchange. Oh yeah. Oh, yeah. And then yeah, of course, as together. infamous said, King Boss from Ranking of Kings. King man, yeah. say hold on, the fact that the, the fact that this man said, "All right, here's the deal. I'm gonna give you power, but I'm gonna take it from your kid." He said, "Okay." Yeah, right. Like, so now your son comes out. You are a giant. Giants can only have one key in this series. Oh. One. Hey, yo, question. Yeah. Did anybody ever seen the show Duraro? Yeah. Yeah. His yeah, father. His father. Oh, yeah, his father. Oh, yeah, his dad. Dad. His, his son's skin, his eyes, his, hair, his yeah. voice. He sold his soul to demons. His whole soul assigned to demon well, for power. Did the same thing. Yeah, they're really? even on that one. Yeah. Well, you know, I gotta get this boy had to literally go out and find all his shit on his own. This man is basically fucking blind and deaf and going out finding all his limbs and shit one by one. Yeah. I'm gonna have a couple more honorable. I just love like three honorable mentions while we've been go talking right now. One Dracula from Castlevania, the anime series. If you want to think, he about had that. a reason. Yeah, just trust me, I get it. He's Another still one, Dracula, though. So yeah, he's still he's Dracula. Dracula. <laughs> Another one. I would think about Full Metal Alchemist again. I would think about Father from Full Metal Alchemist himself. Of course, hey. of course. Father, yeah, the worst father. The worst father. Next. Wait, time are we talking about Full Metal Alchemist bl- Brotherhood or Full Metal Alchemist Brotherhood? Brotherhood. brotherhood. Dad, the oh. dad. Period. He was in both. <laughs> Yeah, not Hohenheim, father. Yeah. Oh, I wasn't thinking about Hohenheim. I was about Hohenheim. I was talking about father. No, 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 I don't blame Hohenheim from that. I do. I don't blame Hohenheim. Uh, like, okay. Hohenheim was understandable. I see both arguments now that I think about it. But I'm leaning more towards he was a bad father. 
don't do something. We even make and don't make sure they don't do it. Pull a gone freeze dad, bro. He did. <laughs> he did it for a reason. So they gone so, free. So they so the gang, but you know, was it worth it? Yes. No, 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 it's worse. It's worse. Hohenheim's worse because Hohenheim knows his homunculus fighting his kids trying to kill him and didn't do shit. Yeah, father's Dick worse. He was yeah, just like, I'm out. So he <laughs> left his kids and found out their mother had a child to come back and kill him. He was he working with the homunculi the entire really time. Just so happened to run up. These niggas knew who he was. <laughs> But the thing is, he was doing so. He had he was trying to set up his own plan. That you know, I'm, I was thinking. I get farther. it. I get it. I get it. But yeah, what was still, the third one? You got a third one. I don't. Know, I thought I had a third one, but I don't. I thought yeah. I had a third one. I have one last one. <laughs> uh, well, two, two, two. One from JoJo's uh, JoJo. Is Dario Brando one of the main dads in there? Uh, the other, I actually had, I just thought about it. I had Daigo on the list. What Duke was talking about, dude, Duke was talking about. Um, the other one is Rengoku's dad. Okay, okay. So, when do we let okay? So, I agree, he was a shit dad, yeah, he was a piece of shit, but. We know why he was a shitty dad. Yes, man. Not everybody we do. takes shit the same way. Not everybody. That's he was handling the stuff that was going on in his life. I, yeah, yeah, but it doesn't stop him from being a shitty dad. But in the end, we saw that he actually cared. True. Don't they all actually cared towards the end? Or they like no, bullshit? No, that didn't care. Mm-hmm. Because dad didn't, didn't care. care. He was like, "Yeah, I'm back." Gene so, definitely you don't give a fuck. He's like, "You this, coming or no?" That's basically have... what he said. Right. Low key, bosses. What is he put a woman on his children? He I did. Thirty-eight. Boss. You watch um, Ranking, Ranking the King. King. The King. Yeah, you yeah. got to watch Ranking the Kings. It's great. I love it. Amazing show. But, Amazing. Uh, he put a woman on his kid. And all oh yeah, that's never good. Body. That's never good. Can't you you can't choose a sin you can't choose a spouse over a child. You Actually, I disagree. No, no, you can go for it. All right. The reason why I disagree with that is because no matter what, you suppose the man's supposed to take care of his spouse. Why? Because the a spouse is like the woman is supposed to take care wait, of the wait, wait, Let me okay. finish. Let me finish. Let me finish. Okay. Okay. Like like the reason why I'm saying that is, if the kids ain't good, she ain't good. If she ain't good, you ain't gonna be good. The only way the kids is gonna be good is if she good. It's it's like a domino effect, yo. It's like it's like the protection of umbrella. You you are her umbrella, and she's the kids' umbrella. I can re- I can respect what you say. It's it's really a perspective when it comes to your relationship, basically though. I will end with that. Right, but listen, 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 listen to what Jay said. Because it's, it's, it's like how it happened. All right. You got to look at it. Yeah, yeah. She's not his wife. She's not the mother. She was like really a side chick. Yeah. Then he fucked up. Yeah, he hey. fucked up. <laughs> then, yeah, he fucked up. <laughs> like, y'all may have seen it as if like, oh, like, he, because like. No, he, no, 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 no. Like, because look, my son was just recently born. My son was recently born. The whole time I'm in the uh, the doctor office, like, yo, is she okay? They're like, yeah, your baby's boy is up. Is she okay? Like, like, no. No, no, no. I get you on that. I get you on that. Yeah, but that was the thing. Like, this was his side chick, basically. Huh, the side yeah. oh, chick he that he raised. Up. Yeah, he let's fucked not, up. Let's put that into it, too. Hold on. Wait, I'm, I'm going to help you out, fam. So, this is the fact. Just, just, just a story. He saved the side chick and basically raised. He groomed her. Right. He had his first son. She killed the first son's mother. He do it. He had his second son and got married again. 
she was trying to go the second son mother and they didn't catch it again now when we're at in the anime the second son wants to marry Sachi. Hey man, listen. Fuck that kid. What Jerry the stuff is that? <laughs> you gotta watch. It makes more sense when you watch. I just gave like a, a bride with trying not to spoil too much, but a bride like this. I feel you on that trail. I was reading through it through uh through it. Stuff. He was like, as a father, if my daughter's mom isn't good, then my daughter's isn't good. And I can respect that. Uh, he's like, I don't do any everything for her, but if she needs something it'll affect her care for my child, then I'm hands in. So okay. <laughs> I have, I have very, and this is my own personal experiences right now when it comes to that. So I'll just give you, just, I'll preface it with that. Not saying that anything is wrong with either or that I disagree with what any, either of you are saying on a real life tip regarding this conversation. However, hold on, what's the anime? Oh, it's a jinx. I just want to see if I can get it before broke out. Hold on. <laughs> trying to catch Nicki Minaj, I see. Well, I'm trying to catch Nicki Minaj. Happy, good, I don't even know what. I just right. putting it out there. <laughs> All right. So, hey, Blaine, that was a that was a meme. That was a meme. Don't blame it me. It was, yeah. Right. <laughs> that was a meme. So I will say this, Trill. Um, if she is unable, for whatever reason, to take care of my child, I will. It does not mean I have to take care of her. Now, this is talking Ooh, about my ex take. as well. Okay, Goku. If I don't, who will? My job is to take care of my child. And I'm not talking about the woman I'm living with that I'm with currently. You know what I mean? I'm talking about my ex and my children. If that's the case, if she needs something, that is her job to provide that. My job is just to make sure my child is okay. And if hey, you can't provide that 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 aid to her, then she can come to me, and I will handle her and take care of my child. But again, that's that's my personal take on that. I think it's funny that we're talking about this now after it happened past weeks. That whole video going viral. With oh the yeah, it's food. Mind you, right? This was in your city. The, it's a skit. It was a skit. The yeah, who was uh, who bought the food is one of my homeboys. And I, I asked him, Was it him? He put me up, but um, basically, what happened? The guy bought food for his child. She oh, asked for it. oh yeah, 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 mm -hmm. yeah, even though it was a skill, but that bought like a whole world on social media for like a week and a half, bro. Yeah, that, that shit was stupid, yo. Yeah, I kind of stood in the middle, I saw both sides, but. Honestly, I felt like I got both sides, but at the same time, I'm just like, I think the person who posted this skit just looked better in my eyes. That's the best way I could put it. Mm. But see, they both, the fact they, both were, were, they wouldn't expect me to go the way it did, and when it did, like, he didn't say nothing else about it, and she kind of kept going with it after people even found out it was skit, which I was like, you should have just said it was a skit. Because that had like people really call the folks, but like the fact of the matter was, yeah, I understand that. Like me and my brother know, um, one thing we can say when our dad did come get us when we was younger, he offered to do stuff for my step brother, step son. Yeah, it was the one time he came to pick me up. He even took my step brother with us to live with him in Atlanta. Mm -hmm. And he took care of all that. Like, yeah, my dad, my yeah, that, that's one thing I can say about that. Nah, he he didn't care. Like he 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 loved kids, but he don't like changing diapers. That's my <laughs> no, that's I understandable. Don't think anybody likes changing diapers, but yeah. <laughs> my dad, number one rule, like he talks to all of us. He's like, he don't mind having kids. They not go with me unless they try to change because I don't change diapers. That's what he told us. I feel that. <laughs> I can respect that. I can respect that. And Terrell, Terrell's like, I don't take care of her. I think it's going to help. She needed new tires and get paid yet. I provide that. If she was unable to care, then I definitely have my child. And, and respect. And that's that's just that's kind of my thing with that. that that's yeah, why that's, that's kind of my thing with that. So definitely, definitely understand you there. And I also, like I said, y'all were talking about your dad. I definitely agree with that logic as well. You know, if the, if the kids need something and I'm able to do it, sure, I don't mind. It's kids. Kids have no control over this bullshit that we go that we put them through. Mm -hmm. They don't. They're innocent victims in a lot of ways. They are. 
that and okay, so I'm gonna bring up this since we're on this. What are y'all thoughts about having children in today's world? I'm scared. I'm really afraid. Yes, I'm scared. I mean, yeah, I'm scared my nephew this weekend, and I'm just wondering, like, wow, how are we gonna protect the world for kids? You know, for innocent kids nowadays, man, it's just. They don't know what's happened. They don't know what the previous generations have done, and they got to live with the consequences like we are. And that's that's not fair. That's not right. I can tell you that from experience, honestly, because my son, he literally just turned one years old, what, two months ago? March 7th? No, May 7th. May 7th. May 7th. Yeah. I fixed it, Jamel. <laughs> I fixed it. May 7th. I that's fixed right, it. That's bro. <laughs> um, don't get me wrong. This shit's hard, yo, especially after this whole COVID thing. Like, mm-hmm. I don't care what you say. You the experience you have with your kid would never be similar to how it was five years ago, ten years ago, six years ago. Like it would never be the same. Every year is gonna be different. You never know what next month rain. Like the the weirdest thing that I ever heard anyone say is if you want to make God laugh, tell him what your plans are. Like you don't you don't know what he got planned for you. Me, all you can, like me, all I can recommend is like just do the best you can, cause like it's hard, cause like my wife, she's still in the military. Me, I got out the military on some on some BS shit. Like, like I don't know if I should make my own little like skit on why my nerd should not join the military, but if 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 so, I will. But the daycare system suck. Like they they'll see like th- this little scratch on his little face and stuff like that. They'll kick him out for three days. That's three days he ain't in daycare. While my, while me and my wife gotta go to work. And it's like and like I'm telling y'all, the world just don't care. So like if like I know for a fact if something was to happen to me and my wife, I know for a fact Kendrick and my baby girl Lee is gonna be taken care of. Why? Because he got people like. Jamel is going to like look after him. His grandma going to look after him. All his grandmas going to be looking after him. His grandparents, his aunties, his, his, his like, like, from what we, we learned, like, from what we experienced, we learned. Like, I seen how shit was going when I was growing up, and nowadays, shit just changed. Like, like Uncle Buck. My uncle. We used to be, like we, we I have I have I can't tell you when the last time I talked to this dude. Mm-hmm. Like stuff happens. It's scary. Like I'm not gonna lie, it is scary. But what's the point of living your life in fear? Sure. Like ah, don't ever live life in fear. Just go for it. Like, don't get me wrong. Like I was scared to have my son Kendrick, but he's became the beacon of my morale. He's became yeah. the my motivation, you know. He's my like, twin, huh? That's scary. My twin. First off, like, don't get me wrong. Like, look, my son's name is Kendrick Robert Calhoun. I named him Kendrick because Kendrick Lamar is my favorite rapper. Hey, yo, mm. shout out to Kendrick. Yo, wait, wait, wait. I'm gonna tell you how bad it was. This boy seeing a video with his son listening to Kendrick <laughs> Martin had a dream. <laughs> Martin had a dream. Wow. But the day that boy was born, look, I looked at like Kendrick had a dream. <laughs> Real <laughs> talk. Look, his name, look, his, look, you just gotta give like make sure his life has just as much meaning as yours. And whether you know it or not, your life has meaning. Because look, Kendrick, Kendrick is a term used back in the day, which means champion among champions, which means king. Like Robert. That is the greatest man I have ever met in my entire life. My grandfather, Robert Thomas. I'm letting him know. Hey, yo, even though you didn't bear a son, you will, your legacy will live on through my son, Kendrick. Robert Thomas. He is also a Cajun. The Cajun blood is strong. I don't care how knuckleheaded we are. I don't care how stubborn we can be. The Cajun blood is fucking strong, though. Like, they said, wait a minute. <laughs> I'm a little attacked. <laughs> hey yo, the only way you can be a part of the Calhoun clan is with the gap. <laughs> I can't be mad. Oh, I'm gonna no, yeah, I, yeah. I understand. I mean, I, I I agree with you. I do agree. I I got 
Ooh. 16, 12, and 5. Shit. Yeah. Uh, three girls. And every day I'm like, this world is getting worse and worse, right? Worse and yeah, worse. Man. And then it's like, do I, would I be opposed to another child? No. Right? I wouldn't be. Because kids are a blessing. They are. Kids are a blessing. Right. You are right. But I would not be having another child. I feel you. I feel you. I'm good. So you That's got, all you me. need. That's I, ain't you got my, I ain't got my boy yet. I ain't got no boy yet. So That's all right. That's why I'm like, mm, I, I, I do, but I don't. <laughs> Look, he like, one more time. One more time. Girl. <laughs> Yeah, right, you that's gonna be my luck. It's gonna be another girl. It's like I don't know if I want to go through that. But it's like so here's my here's a I guess a a devil's advocate look at it. I personally feel that having a kid is selfish. And the Wait, reason what? I say that is selfish. Uh, oh he got he got some he got some. And the reason I say that is because you are deciding to bring a life into this world to deal with the bullshit that you're going to die and leave them in. And they didn't ask (laughs) for this shit. (laughs) Thanks, Mom. Thanks, Dad. Right, thanks. I appreciate it. Think about it. Most Most parents, not all, of course, most parents don't take care of the kids like the kids should be taken care of. They don't raise them in a way that prepares them for the future. They don't... How many times have you seen parents not want to spend time with their kids? I under, as, as a parent, I understand you need a minute to yourself. Yes. Like, I get that. They're, that. That's one thing. You know what I mean? That's because you're raising them, though. Do you see yes. what I'm saying? It's because you're doing what you're supposed to do right. that you need a break. <laughs> But the motherfuckers that ain't doing shit. But the ones who aren't doing anything <laughs> or are doing, doing the bare minimum, you know it, what I mean? That's all they're doing is taking breaks. Or, you know what I'm saying? Things like that. It's, I feel, you said they're just precious commodities that we love to watch mold. <laughs> I don't know. I disagree with the first line. I disagree to say that they're not blessing. But they are precious commodities. The problem is, how are people molding them? And again, if you're even if you're taking question, that man. logic, if you take the logic you just gave, they're commodities that we love to watch mold. That means we are bringing them in for our own selfish reasons. Well, nigga, fuck it, we selfish. To mold them how we want to mold them. Again, that was my devil's right. advocate take on all of it. True. And <laughs> to the fact... Y'all, 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 my brother, right? So yeah, yeah, yeah. I told him this when we finally was having a boy. I was like, okay, I got a question. If my nephew want to play sports, how do you feel about that? My brother hates sports. Mm-hmm. He do. Like the last time he was on the podcast, we started talking about. Oh yeah, we talked about that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> so I like if he wants to play sports and you want somebody to teach him some stuff about sports, you know who you can call. Right. I, I'll be that figure if it comes sports because I love sports. Mm-hmm. Then it was like, well, what if I have a girl? I mean, if I had a boy that hates sports, I was like, they just gonna hate sports. Like, he, they hang out with you when I go watch the Super Bowl or something. Like, <laughs> I mean, but and the, the the phrase it takes a village to raise a child is because of things just like that. Oh, Everybody yeah. has their interests. Everybody has the things that they're good at, and so a kid should have that ability to see. Okay, well, uncle like this, auntie like this, daddy like this. Grandma like this. I like these three things, kind of. I'm going to go kick it with them real quick. You know what I mean? It, it gives them that ability. Um, but, yeah, I didn't want to go too far in the deep off the deep end with that. I feel we kind of we kind of went a little deep. But Yeah, I mean, <laughs> I mean, we, I know we've been joking about anime dads, but we know we know kids are, you know, we know we're, we're not going to joke about kids. But yeah, no, and, no. yeah, like we, we've been making some jokes here, but kids, are, kids are awesome. But hey, fuck them kids. <laughs> okay, oh, sorry, man. Man. We'll say I'm that and I am with you because kids, is, they, they're wonderful. They're amazing. But man, man fuck them kids. 
Anyway, all right, let's switch gears up. Uh, on a parent on a parent role thing, though, I have this that I want to bring up. Uh, Rod actually brought this into the group earlier in the week, and we're talking about the Ninja Turtles. And let me see if I can pull it up here. Do I have it in here? Oh, here it is. Wow. So Splinter, I guess it was reported, intentionally gave the Turtles different weapons yeah than what their personalities like to balance out their personalities so like they were saying it was a reddit this is from a reddit that i've got um they said raf most hothead and violent he gave him a side because it was a, a defensive weapon to teach him patience and discipline mikey being scatterbrained gave him the nunchucks because it was complex and easy to injure the, the actual user themselves. So it made him focus. Uh, Donnie being intelligent gave him something simple. So he has to be more creative with how he uses attacks. And Leo being ethical gave him the katana. Uh, most lethal by default. But to teach him that his ideals may be forced. He, he may be forced to take lives to protect people. And must never battle needlessly. Because of the fact of his ethical like outlook on things. So, with that being the case, if we were to put the right weapons with the right turtle, that was like that would have been their their greatest weapon. One, what weapon? Who should have what weapon? Two, how do you think the team would have turned out? I didn't know Mikey should have got the bow staff. Mikey should have got the bow staff. Why you say that? Mikey, very simple. <laughs> Hold up, real quick. But he would have got bored with it. Trill said, "A little turn, stop glorifying." <laughs> All right, Trill, touche, 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 touche. <laughs> so you said Mikey should get the bow staff, though. Yeah. I can see him getting bored of it, though. I can see him getting bored of it. Right, that's what I'm thinking too. But look at the reason why he gave it to Don. Mikey's already creative. And I think, like, true, he, he, well, that would fit him. I think the, um, the nunchuck fit Leo more. Uh, I don't know. I think nunchuck should have went to Donnie. That's what I, that's what I, think. the more complex item with the more yeah. technical mind. Yeah. Right. That's what I, that's what I, I can see that. Think. So basically, Donnie and, um, Donnie and, um, Mikey switching. Donnie and, and, and Mikey and Rafi switch. Yeah. That's yeah. And Leo and Raf switch. That's how I had it too. Yeah. I had it another yeah. way, actually. I had Raphael and Michelangelo switching weapons, actually. Raf and Mikey. So Raf, the sides were for defense to teach patience and discipline. Mikey don't need patience. That's not his normal MO. Now, technically, if that's the case, Leo should have got the size. That's what we said. He is, yeah, because that's what we were saying earlier. Because he's the patient. Dish, he's nor, the normally patient one. Or, or, what if Donnie got the size? Nah. As a, as a, like, because he's not bad to see Donnie with anything sharp. Sharp? I just don't see Donnie with anything hey. sharp. Mikey, maybe. Yeah, I can't see it. Well, you know, Leo had, I mean, right. Raph had to have the katana. Like, Raph yeah. should have got the katana. Yeah, that's facts, yeah. Flat out. I agree, and, Ryan, and Trail was saying it too. I, I definitely agree with that. I think. But I think Raph with I the katana would probably like, be a, a hindrance because uh, I can see Raphael, I mean, Raphael with, this, with the katanas getting overconfident. I can see him being overconfident with them. That's the point. But that's that's what we're saying. If they got what they, sh what matched their actual. Personality. One, what would it be? And then how would the team have balanced out? Because technically, I don't think it would have been bad if Leo got the size, right? Donnie got the nunchucks, right? Raph got the katana, and Mikey got the bow staff. Right. So wait, it. you mean to tell me the splinter willingly beat in the turtles? Bad father. <laughs> But he did it to balance them out because no fighter needs to go in there all one way. Like you need to be have a balanced personality. Yeah, not Weinstein. 
I think a perfect balance was AL hey, uh, every once in a while. Y'all need to learn how to switch up weapons. I respect that. Like respect you never that. know. Like one of them go down. Like let's say Leo go down and Raph pick up one of his own uh, katanas. Right. Or Mike go down and on Donnie pick up one of his chucks. Uh huh. Like they should be, or better yet, Raph end up throwing one of his chucks to um, Donnie or some shit like that. Last Ronin, right? Have you have you read Last Ronin at all? So you know who it is. Guess I got a special guest. Say hi, Jeremiah. Hey, what up, man? How's it going? Got a future blurring trainer here. It's my nephew Jeremiah. Say hi, Jeremiah. Hi. What's up, hey. Hey, hey. What's your favorite show? Oh, what's your favorite show, Jeremiah? He, Paw Patrol. His favorite show Paw is Paw Patrol. Patrol. I'm with it. Paw Patrol's the truth. Who's your favorite superhero, Jeremiah? He says he says Sonic is his favorite Sonic? hero right now. Hey! All right. <laughs> Good job. He is being trained. Well. <laughs> he is being trained very well. Oh yeah, very well. <laughs> he's he's a very smart young. That's a smart one right there. Shut up, Nightbot. Don't talk to Charles like that. <laughs> Charles, like they all know. How to, yeah, that's just, they do know how to use them. And because that was the one thing with uh, the last Ronin, when he when I'm not gonna spoil it for any people who don't know who the last Ronin is. Uh -huh. If you get a chance, you need to check out Last Ronin. It is the basically there's only one Ninja Turtle left in the world because they all got killed off. Yep. And one of them that's now rocking everybody's weapons and going yep. through and wreaking havoc. So yep. just so y'all know. But they all knew how to use them. They all knew, know how to use everybody's stuff. Yeah, um, with the 36? But they just didn't. I don't know. Like for me. It, I think it's I don't I think they would have been far more dangerous. Yeah. If they had switched. It's funny enough, we were talking about this. There's an IDW comic coming out. Someone duplicated the Ninja Turtles and gave them different weapons. I don't know if it's out yet. They haven't okay. specified the turtles who have the weapons, but they bought I think I might have mentioned this on a previous episode. They bought Venus into the IDW comic. Oh, so there's they? Another, yeah, they bought Venus and as a robot. So Venus is a robot in the IDW huh. verse. But there's another set of turtles out there that did are like in Metalhead? Or do they make her Metalhead? No, they make her Metalhead. I think Metalhead is already in the continuity already. I think Metalhead has okay, already okay. been introduced. What about Sla Slash? Slash has already been introduced in the, right. in the IDW comic. So if yeah, Venus was like the last... Yeah, Venus, I think, was like the last holdover from the 90s that wasn't introduced yet. So she was just, okay. she just came on. So a doctor duplicated the turtles. They all have the same names, Leonardo, Donatello, Raphael, Michelangelo. But the weapons are different. I forgot which turtle had which weapon. I don't remember off the top of my head. Did they keep the same four weapons or just like? They kept the same four weapons, but okay, the okay. turtle who has it is different. I think even the personalities are different from what I remember hearing. Let me see if I can find it really quick. I'll be right back. Let me see if I can find it real quick. Okay. Because, yeah, what I would have loved to see, you know, the, uh, I don't know, I forget what it's called, the weapon where it's like a dart on a chain. Y'all know what I'm talking about? Say it again. The weapon is like a dart on a chain. Like a sickle? Oh. Not not the sickle. It's like it's actually it's like a knife, but it's tied to the end of the chain, and like they you're, they're always spinning it around. Yeah, and they got a a ball on the other side. Yeah, yeah, that one. Yeah, I always um, thought Mikey would have been a beast with something like that. He would. Hey, don't he have it on one of the on shows? I don't. I've seen him use them every. I think I, I think I do remember seeing him use it. I'm gonna tell you what it is. But I mean, like to have that as his actual, his, you know what I mean? Well, he had one on the Nick on the last Nickelodeon show he had. Oh, no, I haven't seen that one. I don't know. I yeah, he had it. Okay, I have to look at that one. Okay, yeah, I don't thought he was good with it. It's a Kus Kasari Gama, Kasari Gama. Okay. So it, it's it's a it's a small sickle. With a chain and then a ball at the end. Yeah, I said it's simple. Yeah. Yeah. No, no. Yeah, I know what you're talking about, but I'm talking about not the sickle at the end, just the uh rope dart. That one. 
Oh, is that the one? I mean, that's the simplest way to look at it. Yeah. But, like, Leo and Raph always oh, yeah. fought anyway. So, for Leo to have the size. Yeah, blood versus crib. Like, that's what I'm saying. Like, for Leo to have the size, yeah. that would have still been perfect. He still would have been able to stop Raph whenever he wanted to. Like, because <laughs> those are the only two that were going to bang. Flat out. Well, them niggas going to bang. All right, so we close to wrapping up. We got a couple other things. I don't think we have much more. We had a couple other things. Um, oh, one thing I wanted to bring up is Saitama. What the fact, heard, that, the fact that they fed, said that they officially made him stronger than Goku? That too. I mean, yeah. let's be real. Ariel was stronger than Goku. Orali, oh, yeah. Okay. You know what I'm saying? Like I forget how you say her name. But yeah. Like, Panda, check the chat. I just put a picture up with Venus with the clone turtles. Okay. I just I'll pull it up here. And that was just a recent free comic book day promotion. So Venus just recently started. So that was a free comic book day comic. There you go. So y'all can kind of see that. Oh, they stitched her together. They yeah, but you see the up. other turtles behind her. That's the phone yeah. turtles. So you don't know a, who they are. <laughs> yeah, they have the names. That's all I know. They all have Leonardo, Donatello, Michelangelo, Raphael, but I don't know which weapon belongs to which turtle. Because gotcha. there's, a, there's a big comic book event called, I think it's either Endgame or City Games or something like that. I forget the name of the comic book comic event, but the kicker with that comic book storyline is Oroku Saki is leading the Ninja Turtles in that fight. So Shredder is going to be mentoring the Turtles. Mm. Oh. That's how crazy ID Double got. It's got to the point where Shredder, Shredder died, came back from hell, and now he's reformed. But he's going to help the Ninja, he's going to help the Turtles out in this multiversal type of tournament or whatever. It's cool. I think it's even called like in-game or city game or something like that. Something game. Huh. Interesting. Yeah, the idea... No, we asked about Slash earlier, Trill. They said he's already in the, in that universe. Yeah, he's kind of like in a... He likes to give hugs and presents from what I from what I was heard, told. <laughs> Hold on, I'll see, I can pull up a quick vi uh, picture of Slash real quick. Because he's in the comic. I'll see if I can find a picture real quick. But yeah, Aria, like, gag manga, I I can never put them in a real fight with anybody. Like, Saitama and uh, what was her name? Ariel, when they had her fight Goku, she bodied him. Like, let me let me just help y'all out here. Give me a second. Help us, Panda. Help us. This little girl, body <laughs> Goku. Riley. <laughs> okay. Where is she now? She's her own. Her own. She's a, she's like Saitama. She's a gag anime character. Yeah. Uh, what is it, Doctor Slug? Uh. Do, 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 do. I forget the name of it. What is it? That is Dr. Slug. Dr. Slump. Yeah. I said Slug, did I miss you? <laughs> but here you go. Early's OP. I love to see Early versus uh, Saitama. Now that would be funny. I got the picture. Give me just a second. Yo. Slash. I got a question. There Why you go. What slash was the last on it? That would be funny, first off. That would be interesting. There we go. 
Sorry, we got it. Okay, I'm back now. I, I did post the picture of Slash. I know someone was asking for IDW Slash. I found it real quick. So I just yeah, posted it in our group chat. Yeah, we showed it on screen for him. All yep. right, cool. Yeah. Yeah. Right on, right yeah. on, right on. Yeah. But, yeah, that's – yeah, like I said, if you're not – if you haven't been following Turtles, I would highly, highly recommend getting into that IDW series. Who knows what they're going to pull for that? I mean, we don't have the next Turtle franchise yet. And I know Rise of TMNT has that Netflix movie coming out next month. So, oh, you got the also, sub- I don't know if you all know or not, there is an Usagi uh, cartoon out right now on Netflix that follows him, the Samurai Rabbit. They just haven't linked it to the Ninja Turtles yet. Yeah, I think that might be his own own universe, though. They haven't said they're going to ever connect to TMNT, but yeah, I saw that. Team. So just as a side note for y'all. Yeah. And then speaking of Ninja Turtles, did y'all all um, play Shredder's Tred- Revenge yet? Or how- oh. Yeah, I finished it, though. I finished it already. I already beat. I haven't beat the hardest mode yet. I've beaten easy, the easy and middle. I haven't beat gnarly yet. I'm I just keep beating me randomly. After I beat it, I just keep jumping in randomly and to random people. And then they'd be like, how'd you get KC? And I'm like, ha bitch. <laughs> <laughs> We will. Uh, we are gonna do a stream on that. We're gonna we're gonna do a uh, a Ninja Turtle stream one day here. So I'll call Casey. I got Johnny. Mike. I got Mikey. Oh, well. <laughs> I go Leo. I go Leo. I go Leo. I got Casey. I honestly, I usually rock with April. So. Oh, my girl likes April too. If I miss out Mikey before then, you can get Mikey. Bad. If you max him out. <laughs> He's at level nine. I just need one more. Uh, I don't have anybody maxed out yet. I only, I only have anybody on my profile. I don't think I have anybody maxed. I know, I know. My girl has Casey. No, she has Casey maxed out. She has. I think she has Casey maxed out already. Nice. Once you maxed out, though, it's so easy. <laughs> Once you get like nah. six or seven, like, you can just kill anybody. Yeah, once you get the radical mode and the story mode, oh my god, that is broken. That is broken. <laughs> I hope they add more to it or something. Yo, it was a little too short for me. They probably that was, sh- that was 16 stages. That was not short. <laughs> that was not short. Bruh. Just where his four was short. He, now he, he's one of those lengthy games. He likes stuff like Skyrim that takes forever to win. What do you mean? Learn my lesson. Bro, look, the last time I ever played Skyrim, you know one of them games you stop playing and you like come back either six months to a year later? Mm-hmm. Bro, I forgot why I stopped playing. So Skyrim got this stupid ass thing where you can save it anytime you fucking want. You think that would help? No. Bro, a year later after I hop back on that, I'm like, man, why I stop playing this shit? I hop back on that shit and I'm on top of a mountain. I'm seeing like, I remember this mountain, but why did I stop playing? Bro, I promise you, I bullshit you not. I remember this step by step. You take two steps from where I saved it at, you will see a fucking blue dragon come circling around. <laughs> you, bro, said, you said I'm not trying to fight him. Bro, to this day, every time I play that shit, I haul ass. All you see is me <laughs> hauling ass down the mountain. I left my fucking helper because she's carrying all my shit. So she's heavy. I'm like, bitch, you better make it. <laughs> you got something I need, bitch, you better make it. Uh, oh, that was I'm playing Breath of the Wild for the first time. I got stuck. I got stuck on the tutorial. I, I was stuck there for like eight hours. No lie, I was stuck yeah. there eight eight hours. I didn't know what the hell to do. I I was be- I was begging like Jodeci on Facebook, like Can someone please help me out. I'm- <laughs> <He's-> <laughs> yo, Breath of the Wild was too fun, yo. So, do can- any of y'all play Elder Scrolls? No, I've heard about it. Just, I have been playing other games, honestly. We we play that shit. If y'all trying to run, let me know. Nigga, we I got Elden Ring. Nah, Elder Scrolls, not I Elden Ring. About one of my best friends that I didn't know. Did not know that one of my best friends did not play online games, and it kind of hurt my feelings. Hey, look, man, shit. I don't like it. I don't like people, bro. <laughs> like, I don't like you're, you're why they made right. that meme. You're why they made that meme. Okay. Where it's like you with a single player mode. It's like, here, come in here and play with the other kids. Yeah. <laughs> Talking about multiplayer. Yeah, for real. I told Oh, them, yeah. 
I told him he got to pull up and sit next to me with a controller if he want to do multiplayer. Wow. Yeah, we'll, we'll get Vogue at one on, with that Pokemon Violet. We're going to get them together. We're going to get them on Violet one of these days. Oh, my people, bro. So uh, <laughs> while I'm thinking about it, we have all the cards for the One Piece trading card game released. Mm-hmm. Uh, I forgot the day for a mirror. I get that, y'all. I am excited for this game. I've been playing the uh, app, the tutorial for like the last few days. I really like this card game. Like, and you know I'm a big you know, player. I really like this card game. Oh wow, that's, that's saying a lot from you, Jay. Because I'm still I'm still on the Yu-Gi-Oh Master um grind, but I've been having fun making my own decks, like using my using the old G monsters from back in the day. Like I got Magna Warrior, I have about eighty five percent complete. I'm missing like two cards I need, but it's, it can do work. It gets the work done. And, Quit confusing me. <laughs> and Jay and Jay knows about my uh, Magna Warrior deck. He, he he got the smoke on that. One. <laughs> but um. With the master rules, right now there are four different decks. No. Green, purple, blue, and red. Each deck has a theme. Um, if you're playing the deck, whatever your leader card is, that's the color of the You can't change the colors. They okay. do have dual leader cards. The card is two colors for now. Um, I'm studying card game now. I'm thinking they're gonna come out with two other colors for the deck, the way it's looking. Um, so of course, I feel they're like gonna have a marine deck. I'm like, won't y'all not have the marines in there somewhere? I feel that like they're sense. gonna have a marine based deck. I see that's coming. Uh, they do have. I sent y'all the link for the um, tutorial app. You can get it on, you know, Apple Music and Google Play. It's called. Let me look it up. One Piece Trading Card Game. I think that's what it's called. I'll show y'all. Okay. Yeah. You got to see it in the bottom of the blue. Uh, okay, cool, cool. I haven't been keeping up with the One Piece game, but that that does sound cool. It's I'm, a actually, I'm actually part. I'm actually getting to the. I'm actually at the halfway point of One Piece now. Officially, I'm at the red line. Like they're they okay. they're Sea Man Island and all that bullshit. Okay, okay, uh, okay. Right. I'm at Sanji's story backstory stuff. I'm waiting to get there. I'm not to get there. Yo. I can't wait to get there. Like, hey. I'm not trying to watch it. Somebody get upset about me watching it, though. <laughs> Have them. Please. Please. Um, okay, so I apologize. I My system dropped in and out, so I don't know if everything was still going through or not. Uh, did you all mention, because I, I know y'all were talking about Yu-Gi-Oh! and the cards. Did y'all mention I was just about to say, can you pull it Oh no, we were talking more about um One Piece. Okay. You're going to pull the card up. Yeah. I got uh, it. Yeah. Well, well, I got that one too. Segue. And Yo. I've got the other one. I'll pull that other card up too. I like yeah, the that. Yes, that. Him, but um. That's a piece, my Yeah, RIP. Yeah. That that that's just sad. He was snorkeling and they found the body. That, that that's sad. Yeah. Oh, what did this they say like, here? Uh, it says game creator card. Oh, that's uh, they give him the blue eyes on stats. He that's that's yeah. the um the human mind in the card game, man. Both. And I can say this for a lot of people who I know, like that man changed a lot of my life. Oh yeah. Mm-hmm. Oh yeah. Wait, you yeah, yeah. like it's really a phenomenon. Yeah, he'll definitely be in heaven, that's for sure. He'll definitely be in heaven. That, that's man. Sure. And um I went to look. A lot of his cards that he did the art for himself has skyrocketed. Mm-hmm. Like he he caught that ultimate. I mean not ultimate uh, alternate art. I can actually show y'all one here. Let's see. And if I could find it. So one of my favorite is courses on um, the Dark Magician Ultimate Art. Alternate art. Anyone oh, I've never that. seen that He's before. Nice. I've never that? seen that one before. Who that? Oh, that's what he did. Dark that's Magician. Yeah, that's fine. That's his sick. I've never seen him look like that. Oh, that's nice. Got another one. Oh, oh that's, that's cool. Yeah. On it. Oh, that's worth that. Those cards, are, those cards are worth a lot of money now. I hate to say oh, it like yeah. that. No, I just want this. I know, but. 
Yeah, it's just that. I mean, six. I mean, he was only sixty-two. He was kind of young when you think about it. Mm-hmm. They. It's a lot of different stories. Somebody said fifty-eight. Somebody said six, and somebody said sixty-two. I thought it was fifty. No, he older than that. No, I, was, uh, I thought sixty. I know I saw sixty somewhere. Yeah, I saw sixty. And somebody said it was actually fifty. Just look it up. I mean, either or. Just look it up. Yeah, that was the problem. A couple of different people were saying different things. There's no definitive answer. Where you coming from? Yeah. But still weird. Uh, yeah, it's, it's still kind of weird the way. I mean, if you snorkeling in your body, I, I don't know that. I mean. Uh, like I will say this, people people sleep on the number of species in the ocean, and he's off the coast of Japan. Hey, it could have been a small you know, Portuguese, you right? It could have been a Portuguese man of war. It could have been something smaller than that, like could have been a mermaid. Yeah, that too. That too could have been Godzilla. Could have been the dragons. Could have been Godzilla. That's my story. He got taken out by Godzilla, period. Or I didn't Cthulhu. deserve to be taken out by legends. Bow. Not Cthulhu. Not Cthulhu. You know what? On that, 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 that. I no, no, no. He's 60 no. and he was born on October 4th. Are you yeah, serious? I'm looking at you. Yeah, yeah. Oh, that's dope. Uh. That's I wonder why you like his shit so much. That's any good birthday. Wow. October 4th. Small like, world. All right. Well, we got to our uh, two-hour mark. We're going to go ahead and kind of cut it down. One last thing, though. I know Jay wanted to do the Buzz Lightyear review. Just got to watch it again. (laughs) Wait. Since my brother is here and he went with me, (laughs) I'm going to let him speak on it first. Go for it. Okay, we went Bro, I wanted to walk in that theater and personally walk in with a Buzz Lightyear action figure. <laughs> I'm going to give you a Buzz Lightyear action figure. One of the older ones, not the new bullshit ones. Bro, <laughs> I don't care. I, like, are we doing spoilers or no? Yeah, go ahead. Yeah. Bro, everyone for every character. Socks. Socks would be our favorite character. All right. <laughs> Wow, like, not surprised. Even to the look, look, I like how thorough they was with Buzz Lightyear. They tied him to his um, they tied the original character to the um to the Toy Story character so fucking well. Like every catchphrase he wow. say, I, I call him all when he be sitting there dialogue and all that shit. Yeah. Every the thing, not today, sir. All that shit. Wow. Okay. I was all that shit. I was like, he said it. He said it. Yeah. <laughs> Yo, we we would have a moment. But so, backstory, anybody who hasn't seen it, this is the story of Buzz Lightyear. It has nothing to do with Toy Story. Right. Nothing at all. It's basically where the character came from for the toy in Toy Story. Yeah. It's basically the story of Buzz Lightyear himself. So, you have the Buzz Lightyear story. And remember, while back, they had a Buzz Lightyear cartoon. Yes. nothing to do with That was something totally different for the kids. This Buzz Lightyear story was not his. Oh, um, make it to make it short without really spoiling it. We're following Buzz Lightyear. It is it, the whole story is kind of sad if you watch it. It really we're is. We're following Buzz Lightyear. Um, we learning about him and everything. My thing is, after watching this movie, watch it again. I saw something you got that kind of struck me. I don't know if y'all remember the movie Titan AE. Yeah. I know you remember it. But you know the ship at the end of the movie that rebuilt yeah. Earth? Yeah. That was the very first ship that we thought Buzz Lightyear in. And if you pay attention to the story, they line up almost perfectly. Too perfectly. What, Titan AE like, to Buzz Lightyear? Titan AE in this Buzz Lightyear story. Oh, wow. Yes. So the Titan story, you know, Earth was like not not how will they left Earth, right? And you know the they try to destroy Earth and all this and that, but the ship fits the same build and this the the mission that the original cast had fits what they was doing. 
And I'm like, bro, y'all can nick that together. I promise you, I'm gonna have a geek moment. <laughs> oh wow! But it is. It got a lot of bad reviews. Mm -hmm. Go in there and not think about it. It is a good movie. The only reason why it got bad reviews was because it didn't get as many people in it. The only reason why it got bad reviews was because it came out the same time of Jurassic World. Everybody, everybody went to go see Jurassic World. Fuck Jurassic World. I had to see my boy in action. They explained how he got his wings. They explained how he got his lasers. They explained all that shit. Catch that Pokemon. Nice. <laughs> right. <laughs> everybody's going to everybody's going to catch the Pokemon. <laughs> oh, Dust Noir too. That's a good one. Oh snap. Yep, you got 90 seconds to respond. It says I don't have a Pokeball. I don't own that ball. Darn it! Pandemonium too earlier. Yeah, it happened to me again. Him again. <laughs> I'm gonna do it again. How many y'all got? I, I might, I might be, I might be, uh, I might have too many. I just started. Let me see how many I got. <laughs> how do you trade? Really release some Pokemon. So let's see here. Pokemon community game is what it is. Uh. If you have Twitch, you're on your Twitch account, it'll be there. So, um, back to the movie. Um, great watch. The story, there's slight time travel in story. For people who don't, I don't people who don't like time travel still because it kind of. It, it's not really. Um, for, no, it's yeah, not, it was the main thing. It's not, it's not going to mess a movie. Like, it make, it make movie make more sense. Okay. Okay. Represent LGBT. Yeah, they. Yeah, I was gonna say that too. They do have a little LGBT. Okay. For people who are. Yeah. Old, but it's not. It, it's, it's like it fits. So, yeah, it fits I think so so one chick lesbian, but don't two chick lesbian. Yeah, I mean, as long as it's not. Mm, you right. I don't know you about like that. You're fine. Yeah, I, I was happy it wasn't two dudes too. I was happy to know it wasn't two dudes. I was cool with that. Not that I'm like, oh, cool, two females. No, I'm just cool. I'm not seeing two dudes kissing and shit. No, I'm good. I'm good. Preferences are preferences. I understand. Right. Oh. Um, but no, I did hear. I did hear that that was a big up. For some reason, that was a big uproar too. Uh, I don't see why they know Disney is trying to implement that shit. Yeah. I thought more people wouldn't yeah. see because because Chris Pratt was in the movie. Honestly, was, was it Chris Pratt? Pratt? No, 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 no. That was Captain America. Yeah, hey, I caught it. Chris Evans. Oh, shit. yeah, Evans. Yeah, yeah, yeah. My yeah, bad. Don't bring don't bring Pratt into this. Hey, well, speaking of which, hey, it was off topic thing, but I ain't gonna lie, and I say this wholeheartedly: the best on uh, LGBTQ TV show I have ever watched. Had to be undoubtedly Steven Universe. Yeah, oh, yeah. that Steven was a Universe. very good TV. Show. I did not know that Nicki Minaj actually voice uh, acting in that show too. Yeah, I, I didn't know that. I didn't know that. Yeah, she was Garmin and Amethyst, the fusion of Garmin and Amethyst. Oh, word! That was Nicki. Yeah, that was Nicki. Damn, that's crazy. Oh, that's cool. That's pretty cool. I know what's her when she laughed. I'm like, that's Nicki. <laughs> he said it was the laugh. I think my favorite scene on that show was when they split Steven up and it was just Jim Steven and regular Steven. And there's like, where's Pink Diamond? And he whispered, he was like, she's gone. And she's like, what? She's gone. And he just roared. I was like, damn. Oh, you better fuck some shit up. Ain't I haven't watched Steven Universe. Ain't it's, it's one of those shows that has like a real anime core to it. Bro, like I look like the singing kind of pulls away from it, but it's it's nah bro. I promise you, once you get into it a little bit more, it gets serious. Like he finds out, look, first off, fuck Pink Diamond. Fuck her. Fuck her. She was the worst <laughs> out of everybody. 
She she was everybody enemy. She did everybody dirty. Everything she did, she did it out of selfishness. She mm. claimed that she was trying to help people, but no, she was just being selfish. Um, Penelope, she did her the most dirtiest. She did her dirty. I don't know if y'all seen that Steven Universe the Future movie, but there was a whole character that she just left abandoned on the planet because she wanted to go out and do what the fuck she wanted to do. So I was like, yo, fuck Pink Diamond, yo. She put her son through too much shit. She put her baby daddy through too much shit. She put the dot of the, the crystal gems through too much shit for her own personal shit. Yo, fuck Pink right. Diamond. Steven's mom, fuck her. Fuck she was the worst mom by far. If we make a list of the worst moms. moms she gonna be number one on my list. <laughs> All right, we'll, now. we'll pull that one up. We'll pull that one up. Um, real quick, before we close out, a couple things I wanna uh, I wanna post or put out there for next show. We're gonna pull top ten fire users, top ten water users. That's gonna be crazy. Top ten lightning users. It'll be one of those three. We are we doing all three? One of three. One of the three. Oh, yeah. Okay. So we one of three. We'll make the decision, but just for everybody watching, so they know it's gonna be one of them three. Oh, okay. Because I'm like, nigga, three. That's a lot. Yeah, I know. That's a lot. That's doing too much. (laughs) So you know, Boji's the top fire user, the top water user, the top light. Really, really, really. Bogey. He's going Dylon, Dylon, Dylon. Dylon, Dylon, Dylon. Because I spit that fire. I spit that fire, man. All right. Well, yo, we appreciate y'all coming through. As always, it's the Wilds of Pandemonium. You never know what you're going to expect. But yes. enjoy your week. We will catch y'all next Sunday. Oh, we might be a little late. But we will catch y'all next Sunday. All right? And we have seven days. One, seven two, days. Three, four, five, seven old days and not a word from and the you countdown to Dragon Con. The countdown to Dragon Con has Y'all begun. Come to Dragon Con, let us know. Link up, let's go. After all this. All that. Before we go, anybody seen that new Dragon Ball Z movie yet? Not yet. Nope. Not yet. Wait for the dub. The same here. Thank you. Y'all niggas in y'all dub. Nah, for Dragon Ball, it gotta be dub, bro. Yeah, yeah. Dragon Ball is an exception to the rule. Yeah. There is always an exception. Dragon Ball is that exception. Dragon, yeah, Dragon Ball is that exception. Think about the clip we were talking about earlier. That I sent y'all the dub scene in particular. Oh yeah, yeah, I saw that and I was like, yeah. Hey, that, don't they come out in August though? It's not even out yet here. No, yeah, it's August. I think the tickets. I think I said it earlier. Make, yeah, go on sale next weekend. Next weekend. Yep. Yep. So, was well, everybody? Yeah, I wish it came out the same weekend we was all together. So oh, that would be. I was hoping. I really was hoping, but yeah, I think about a week. What a weekend short for you guys? I think about a weekend off. Yeah. No, nah, it's about a whole. It's about a month. About a month. Oh, okay. Yeah, it's like two, three weeks, I think, because it's the beginning of August, isn't it? If it was on August twenty second. Oh, twenty second. Then no, it's a week. Yeah. Then it's one week off. I mean. Y'all wanna do that? We can, or I mean, Wait, you what? know, it's gonna be heck, of, heck of spoilers though all, all week. I mean, I've already been spo- I already know what's gonna happen. I yeah, true, watch true. It, we already know. My 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 Japan movie. spoiled everything. Thank you, Japan. Right. Wait, we talking uh, about? Yeah, I'm with it. When they come out, twenty second that weekend. The Dragon Con is next weekend. The weekend after. <laughs> Oh, they're gonna, oh yeah, and that, that you know that movie's gonna be in there for a couple of weekends. So that second weekend, that yeah, I'm, I better book that early. Right, we have to check that like <laughs> soon as tickets drop. I I put it, I put it, I flag it on Fandango so I can go on the tickets. All right, let us know what it is as well. Let us know times and stuff. We'll get that taken care of. We'll cap over there losing in two K. I'm actually winning, motherfucker. <laughs> <laughs> And yeah. I just won the three point contest too. Oh. What? Yeah. Speaking yeah. of two K, I heard they did. I heard they're doing Russell Westbrook dirty in two K twenty three. Think they dropped his overall rating to like a seventy six from what I heard. That's funny. Seventy six is crazy. That's petty. Yo, that yo seventy six is crazy. <laughs> <laughs> yep, we he does not like sports. He does not. Anyway, <laughs> yo, before we get into that, we out. We catch y'all Bye. next week. <laughs> Yo, Later. Is crazy, bro. All right.